my little peaches. Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to some more vampire extreme vampire challenge. If you don't know what this is, go ahead and watch it right from the start because it is an extreme legacy challenge. 10 generations on the most expensive lot in the game with um, really high bills and you have to go from nothing to hopefully a beautiful legacy. That is the idea. We decided to do it with vampires to make it harder. And I also make all my vampires die in the sun because, you know, vampires, that's what they're meant to do. However, this has proved tricky. Watch the last episode if you don't want any spoilers because we're going to get into things right now. Also, if you're on YouTube, YouTube, Twitch is saying hello to you guys here. So if you're on YouTube and you want to say hello to Twitch, go ahead and comment hello Twitch in the comments below. Also, I hope this spooky music is spooky enough for you guys. So, I'm going to go ahead and turn on my shaders because uh, you know how we do. We like things to be um, really colorful <laughs> and really bright. So we'll go ahead and turn those on. Um, <laughs> so yeah, the last episode. Should we just take a, a moment to talk about the last episode? Because a lot happened. Um, a lot happened. So the plant possession that our heir, um, Claudia von Siegenwied, had caused her to go outside in the sun and she burned to death and died. Honestly, not mad about that. It was um, it was a really good way for her to die. Honestly, because the plant had taken over her. I was trying to work out how the plant could kill her and the plant was like, babes, don't worry, I got you. And it killed her. So I'm like, okay, fine. Fine, fair enough, that's great. However, shortly after that, because Riku was aired, uh, was um, cattle, and tied forever to Claudia, he died not long after. Because heirs cannot live. The music's a little loud. Yeah, I thought it might be. I'm gonna turn it down a bit for you guys. Um, he can't live without his vampire. So he died not long after. Um, not long after that, we were like, let's get a cow plant. That will be so vibey. Riku got it from work. It can be a way for him to as to remember him. Um, I forgot to feed it and the cow plant died as well. So at this point, the death total is on three. At this point, I think if I was on GTA, I'd probably be at two stars. Two stars, I would say. Like, the FBI isn't after me yet. I can probably still outrun the police and try and get down to one star. As long as I don't kill anybody else, I'll be fine and I don't need to do a whole police run. GTA 3 is the one I'm basing it on because that will forever be my GTA. Um, so yeah, then the cow plant died. Big Sag, Sag everywhere. And then I sent Maya out just to kill some tourists, as you do, like very normal behavior, just go kill some tourists because they're annoying and they wear ugly clothes and they take pictures of your house. However, um, it turns out her vampire power was really low. So when I sent her out to go and clean up the tourists, she also died in the sunlight. Now, the reason this is actually quite sudge and quite stressful is she was our heir. If you notice, she has the sun inside of her chest because she died by the sunlight, so she will always have the sun inside of her heart. Which is not what you want as a vampire because the sun is deadly. The sun is very deadly. So, at this point, I was definitely, I killed the extra person. I was three stars wanted. The FBI were coming for me. You can't, it's very hard at this point to try and reduce your star level. Even if I go out into the hills and the mountains, they're gonna send the helicopters, they're gonna send the big trucks that just drive and cause chaos. There's no way for me to get out of this situation. So, um, Scott, uh, Claire has a son in my heart. Well, it's so freaking cute, thank you. Sorry, detour. Yeah, it was a traumatic episode. It was wild, there was a lot of shock factor. I, you actually aren't meant to have vampires as ghosts, but I got some cheats just so we could see Maya because honestly the girl is a freaking vibe and I was really excited for her to be out there. She is the only one who can turn other vampires, so she was a whole vibe and she was working on changing all of her, um, okay, she's not apparently in any clubs anymore. She was working on adding all of her siblings to the vampire club, um, which... Oh, a new vampire! A new vampire! Okay, very, very exciting. I don't know who Avaro, Avaro, Avaro is, but we're gonna add him. Um, so yeah, she was working on changing all of her half-siblings into vampires. They hated this, but we were kind of forcing them to do it just for vibes. So Anne became a vampire. Well, she will become a vampire soon. Jody became a vampire. There's also one more who's not appearing on there. The Hottie Vampire. I don't know where he has gone. 
But he apparently is not on here anymore. Trent. Trent will be a vampire, so I will invite both of them around and they will complete their final um, vampire form. Um, oh, well. They hate each other. They are deep, deeply wounded. Which left me with a little bit of a conundrum. It did leave me with a little bit of a conundrum. Don't go to high school. I'm just going to keep you all inside the house now. So my conundrum was, my conundrum was, who do I keep as my heir? Do I keep Maya, who was my original heir, and is now a ghost? I could do everything in my power to bring her back to life. I even bought a well so that she could wish for mortality. However, we would have to use up a bunch of the money, which obviously is very difficult in this challenge. Or has Draco, the one who was... A oh, look at him. And he's, he's, he doesn't wear pants to bed. He likes a free-flowing bit of air around his bejoolies for bed. Um, would, would Draco actually get the opportunity to become the heir? The only one who survived. The one who was meant to be... Cast aside, thrown out into the eye, the wild, like a baby elephant. Would we instead give him the chance? If you're on Twitch, I'm about to pay out on the prediction. I have chosen who the heir is. The heir for this challenge, which was meant to be a female-only challenge, is in fact going to be Draco. I checked on YouTube. If you're watching on YouTube, I checked on your comments. Also, a bunch of you guys were saying this on, on Twitch as well. I never planned for this to be the case. However, he outlived them all. I feel like he's earned his right. He has earned his right to be, um, to be the heir of this challenge. So, there he is. No pants and all. Going back to sleep. He's earned it, guys. He has 100 million percent owned this right. However, Maya's still floating around. Um, I don't really know what to do with her. I really don't know what to do with her. Yeah, the legacy is now co-ed. The legacy is now co-ed. Uh, I'm going to turn the music down on here and then turn it up on here because I can't hear the game. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Wait. There we go. Okay. So yeah, the air is going to be Draco, which is it's kind of exciting. It's not the way I planned for this to go. I also feel like Maya had the better genes, but he earned it. He earned it, guys. So what can we do? What else can we do? <gasps> and Angelically Evil is celebrated with 50 subs. 50 subs to celebrate Draco being the air. What? What? Angelically evil, naughty step, naughty step for you right now, vote naughty step, uh, but celebrations as well, so we'll try and do this without stumbling on our words. Bino has moved, so let me pop Bino back on the camera in front of the twirly wheel. 50 subs is freaking wild, and a bunch of you guys got paid out. A bunch of you guys did get paid out for that, so that's pretty awesome. I hope you enjoyed your payout of points, and are you ready? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, no more, okay? Get your butt on that naughty step. I'll give you a cushion. You can have an owler. No, a hoot, a hoot, hoot. Or is it an owler? I think it's an owler or a hoot, hoot. Whoever this fella is, you can have him on the step. I'll put him on the step for you. But you have to go on the naughty step now. Taz lent me it especially for your butt, please. Lots of love and hearts. If you're one of the 50 people who just got gifted by Angelically Evil, please make sure you say thank you in the chat. And give them an absolute bunch of love, please. Angelic the Evil, you are so sweet and wonderful. You are evilly angelic. That's what you are. Evilly angelic. That is what you are. No! Highly illegal. Highly illegal behavior. Three stars wanted. FBI, 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 open up. FBI, open up. It's a rowlet. Thank you. FBI, open up right now. Because Angelic the Evil just gifted 10 more subs. Highly illegal behavior. Highly illegal behavior right there. Angelically evil. What? 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more gifted subs. I want the most, like, fully angelic, evilly angelic shaped love chart right now. The chart should be shaped like angelically evil right now, because that's freaking wild. FBI, open up. Take angelically evil, but give her a really nice sell, because she deserves it. <laughs> Here we go. A bunch of love for you, Angelica Evil. Thank you so, so much. We always appreciate you in these streams. Thank you for the posture check, Megan. I'm actually gonna, I've sat, I'm sat cross-legged, which is not good posture. So I'm gonna put my feet onto the ground flat. Thank you so much, so much for those. 200, 200 gifted subs this week. Thank you so, so much. We also had Mel, Mel, Milo's girl with the bits in there. Claire, love you. Thank you for helping me through my grandparents lost your mom's surgery. This is your first ever stream and you use the pansexual pride um, little emote as well. Milo girl, sending you some big, big hugs. Um, hope that your um, mom's surgery went okay as well. Hope she's recovering well. Kitty Oon, thank you so much for being here for five months. Mia Le Le uh, Mia Lebel, thank you so much for the bids. Can Maya still turn people as a ghost? We shall find out. We shall find out. Also, yep, I caught um Je uh, Gem Jen, thank you so much for subscribing with your Amazon Prime in the midst of all that beautiful chaos. Emily Adele, thank you so so much for the bids. Ymark, thank you so much for being here for two months in a row. Sweet animatrix, thank you so much for the win. 200 bits. You recently got a promotion after w at work after being there for less than two months. <gasps> Can we get some hype in the chat for sweet animatrix? My general manager asked for me by name for this promotion, so it's going position, so it's going great. I'm in love with it. I had a question: How do you get your cast to be four across like that? I love it and want mine to be like that. Google um, Sims 4 CC four columns cast. It's a patron free post. You can get that, it's really, really good. Emily Gracie, thank you so much for subscribing using your Amazon Prime. Welcome to the Peaches. Jess Nasha, thank you so much for being here for two months in a row. You're the coolest. Isla Perch Purchase, thank you so much for subscribing using Amazon Prime as well. Welcome to the Peaches. And Miles of Nikki, thank you so much for the bits. You started watching a K drama called Un Uncanny Encounter on Netflix. It's amazing. If you haven't, if you like it and if you haven't seen it and watch Supernatural Vibes, I highly recommend it. We are still watching Startup, but we've only got one episode left. So that's very, very cool. Thank you for the recommendation. Okay, I'm gonna catch up on everybody else's in just a moment because I think we're gonna get some money in game. Take the money, 800 pounds. Because, 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 because. Um, money is gonna be hard. We've lost two of our breadwinners, which is Riku. And we've also obviously lost Claudia. Claudia is downstairs. God rest her soul. Wait, no, she's a vampire. Devil rest, Satan rest her soul. She is down here. She has a portrait. I mean, honestly, full queen, full queen. And the principal's calling. Don't, you don't need to answer that, babes. Don't worry about that. In fact, I feel like I can drop you out of school. No, I disabled that. I disabled that. I want to just get you a job, like a full-time job. Because we kind of need the money, babes. We kind of need the money. I do need to get a new castle. I do need new castle. I feel like the castle... We had that girl at the end of the last episode, didn't we? Oh, I still... I already have my job, right? I already got the job. Yeah, we're a wave watcher. He, and he needs to improve his fitness. So I might have to buy him some weights equipment in the house because... I mean, we can't go for a jog during the day. It will literally kill us. So where's he just disappeared off to? Oh, he's over here. That feels like an unnecessary flex. That felt like an unnecessary flex. Um, um, Rosie Posey, thank you so much for the win. 200 bits. And BTS Luna, thank you so much for being here for seven months in a row. Okay, do we have a picture? Oh, look. We actually have her room all ready to go. And we had Draco outside because he was not meant to... He won't... Technically, Maya won't get her own... Should I still make her a room? Even if she's not an heir? Or does she move here and Draco moves here? Like literally that is what happens because he's in air now. Maya isn't because she can't, she can't be. She can't make young'uns. And actually, if we make Draco, oh, there's Maya's. Yeah, there is a, okay. I think a mod needs to put you on the step officially. I can put you on the step. Wait, where's my step emote gone? My step thing. Oh, I, ca I can't do the step anymore. Let me try it. Oh, there we go. I sent you to the step. I sent you to the step. Um, what? Um, 
Maya might have to just have a little table out here for like the non airs table. I'll just pop her here for now. I'll pop her under her picture for now. I mean, she's dead. So, and we'll sell these school projects. And what I was thinking is with Draco, previously I would just like get a uh, sim to procreate with and then like immediately just kill them. Cause like, you know, with a female sim, the baby's there. So like, I don't need the male anymore. But with Draco, yes, this is what I need you to do. I need you to increase your fitness levels. This is really good. Keep doing that. Um, with Draco, if he gets someone pregnant, they have to live with us. So maybe whoever he gets pregnant becomes the cattle and we work a little bit differently. What do you guys reckon? Do you think that we should keep, that we should make the baby mama the cattle this time round and do things a little bit differently? What do you guys reckon? Yeah, Maya's jeans were god tier. Yeah, you guys like that. Okay, who was the girl? Who was it that he didn't hate last episode? Violet. There she is, Violet. Shall I check? Let's check her out in cuss. She can help raise the babies too. Yeah, that's a good point. I don't know what to do with Ghost Maya now though. Algorithm. Ghost Maya, I really don't know what to do with. Okay, so this is Violet. Violet is a young adult. And Violet has been kind of hanging around Draco. I'm probably gonna just tweak the whole of Violet and just make her more vibey. But I will keep the pink pigtails because I'm already seeing no chin. No chin to speak of. Why does my game hate chins? I do not know. Um, but I'm gonna fix that. Um, and actually give her a bit more chin. Might move her chin forward a little bit too. And honestly, she's kind of cute. It's not the god tier genetics that Maya had, unfortunately. But you know, they're nothing to turn your nose up at. She does, she has potential. She's, she do got potential. And if we're going to be keeping her around, I just want to make her like cute, you know? Was she a celebrity's daughter? I don't know, maybe. This is a big family. This is a big family. I feel like we might have gone around to their house to try and kill them once. <laughs> Which is kind of awkward. But it's also the vampire challenge. This stuff... This stuff happens more than you would think. So... If you bring her back, you could kind of start the family not hating humans so much. But if Violet's around, she's a gloomy, snobby, neat sim. Maybe then the fact that there's a human around makes the next gen not be so evil. I don't know. We are using the traits generator and it takes both parents' traits. Their kids might not get the evil trait this time around. So can you change the lips from the side profile? In what way? How I change the lips how? Like bring them out or in or? I, I, she can't, cause she's got like the cute pink hair. I kind of want to make her like a little bit like sort of adorbs anime vibes. That's kind of what I'm thinking. How much money does she have? Oh my gosh, we don't know. That's a really good point. We need to, uh, we need that dollar dollar. Yeah, I don't want the evil trait this time cause I find the evil trait such a pain to deal with. Um, but we are using it for this challenge. Um, just cause apparently we like to torture ourselves, but we've used it with everyone so far, so I do want to keep using it. How is Draco a lifeguard? He goes into the sea being like, oh no, they're dying. And then when he gets there, he just kills them in the water. And he he, he goes in the shade to do this somehow. I don't know, work with me here, going along. Work with me on this. Um, I might try a little lychee number for this. What's the lychee one look like? Oh no, I like that one more. I like this one, and do we want to add some little frecklerinos? Now she didn't have freckles to begin with, did she? Yeah, he's an in indoor lifeguard. Yeah, that's it. He's an indoor lifeguard. Yeah, I think she's got really cute lips, honestly. I like her lips a lot. I think she's a very adorable little sim, to be honest. Hopefully, she's going to bring us some good genetics. Um... Because we're going to need them for our future babblerinos. Yeah, I think there's potential with this girl. This girl definitely has cute vibes potential. Um, and let's give her some lashes. And I will be giving her that cute pink hair that she had before because it was adorable. 
And I like that she's called Violet Medley. It's such like a whimsical cute name and she's gonna be... She's, she's gonna have to be a little vampire's thrall. Sag, Sag. Is she gonna babies with Draco? Yes. Yes, I think she is. Uh, BTS Luna, thank you so much for being for seven months. Emily Adele, thank you so much for the bits. Have been with you since Dreamhouse. You always make me smile and laugh. I'm so glad I found you when I did. Thank you so much for the long-term support. And Saz, thank you so much for the bits. Um, sell the wishing well since Draco's air. That's a re that'd be a good way to get us a bit of money because we were saving for it last episode. Um, Tay Tay, thank you so much for the bits as well. Okay, what do you guys think of this cute new hair? Oh, I don't know if she doesn't have enough forehead for it actually. Yeah, her forehead might be a bit too small for this hair. No, we wanted to go for the piggies, didn't we? We wanted to go for those piggy tails from before. Okay, let me find some piggy tails for her. Um, Because she did have adorbs pigtails. I like the chunky pigtails. Like... um, Where are... are they? There's like chunky shorter ones. Where are they? Uh, here. And they were like pinky purple, weren't they? She's just like, I'm cute, I'm anime, and I'm like, you're a vampire slave. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know this one I don't think we're going to have to kill her. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to get, oh, I don't know if I'll be able to match. I've lost some of my fringes. I don't know where they went. They, they left though. And they were my shiny fringes. They were the ones that were really easy to match. Whereas these ones are like not shiny fringes. So they're a lot harder to match. Like that doesn't really work, does it? Hmm. I don't think I've got a Pigos. Oh, I could use the Lilith hair actually. Oh, well let's try that because that has a bit of fringe. And I can put some of these little thing numbers in it. Okay, let me find this Lilith hair. It's like by Leah Lilith and I used it on Lilith, which is why I called it the Lilith hair. Those fringes only really match simplicity hairs. Uh, simplicity, sorry. I like to add extra vowels for no reason. Yeah, I had some cool shiny fringes. I don't know where they went. I think it's when I did a batch fix, it broke them. So I'll probably go back through and try and find them. Okay, here's the Leah Lilith hairs. Where is the one with the pigos? Where is that hair? Oh gosh, I've not used that hair in so long. And I love that hair. If I've scrolled past it, please let me know because sometimes it's hard to see things when you're the one controlling it. I don't, I know that doesn't make sense, but it's the truth. Yeah, Draco is the heir. We voted. Oh, maybe that hair's gone. Because that was all the lead. Oh, here it is. Okay, boom. And she had like purpley hair, right? Was it pinky or purpley? I kind of like it pinky. And then we'll make these purpley. That's kind of cute. She's kind of kept that little anime vibe, right? I kind of like them red. And then... What color eyes did she have? Oh, she's got brown eyes. I was going to give her purple eyes just to match her anime cute vibes. And then if I'm doing that, I'm going to soften her eyebrows down a little bit to match her hair a bit more. Maybe give them a bit more warmth. Like so. What do you guys think? It is quite... You you like the pinky. I think that's cute. She's looking cute. She is looking cute. <gasps> Jessie Omatic with the... Oh my gosh. Can we get some hearts in the chat for Jessie Omatic, please? With the wet tea. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twenty, thirty, fifty, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, twenty-ten, twenty-eleven, twenty-twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty-five. I'm trying to uh, get a job at a bidding house. You know, an auction house. That's why I'm practicing. Thank you so much for the twenty-five gifted subs. If you were gifted by Jess Omatic, please make sure you say thank you in the chat. Jess, thank you so much for the twenty-five. Here is a bunch of love from myself and the community. And also, um, welcome to the squad new features. Hello, hello, hello. Also, um, Kamal, Kamal, uh, Kam, 
Kamali Hiwa, thank you so much for the bids. Can we give her a better room than Riku's? Um, I have Drake, Draco treat her well. Maybe he'll be happier since his mum and sister aren't making him miserable and he wants to be on good terms with Violet. See, the thing is, though, he's evil too. I know we like to try and soft boy um, Draco, but he's not a nice person either. Like, he's an evil person too. He's no different to them. So, um, I don't know if we're, go we're jumping the gun with trying to make um, Draco nice. I don't think he's nice yet. I think we have to go a bit further down the line to start getting nice simps, you know? Um, Nikki Fogg, thank you so much for two months in a row. Love watching your videos, Claire. You have such an amazing personality and sense of humor. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, thank you so much, Nikki. And also, Pixel Mum, thank you so much for eight months of the Amazon Prime. Eight months flew by listening to your streams while I bake. It's like having a friend and a bunch of peaches over. Oh my gosh, the cozy energy I just got from you right there, Pixel Mum, was exquisite. What are you baking? Please let me know. And Modern Warfare 2, girl. Is that what that stands for? MW2? In my head, it's Modern Warfare 2 because that was my favorite card. Thank you so much for the bids. I've been watching you since the first episode of Dreamhouse. Um, I have autism and I love all your videos. You make my life so much happier during lockdown. I'm so, so glad to, um, to make your life happier and I hope your lockdown's going okay. And Tay Tay, thank you so much for the bids as well. Jess, thank you so, so much. I appreciate that so much. Okay, let's get some... I'm going to keep this kind of adorbs um, anime energy to this girl because I just feel like she had that about her. And there's something extra evil about breaking the spirit of, like, happy anime girl. <laughs> That's what the evil part of me says anyway. And that is what I try and embody when I do this whole challenge. So it feels very fitting um, that we break cute anime girl's spirit. Wow, this, this, this challenge really finds something in me, doesn't it? It really does. It really finds some level. <gasps> Taz, oh my gosh, trust you to join as I talk about breaking the spirit of cute anime girl. What? Can we get some Taz-shaped love in the chat, please? <gasps> Taz, what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Taz gave a thousand bits. What? Taz, how did your stream go? Hello. Hope your stream was super shiny and you had a beautiful time. Does anybody else who watched Firefly still say shiny, by the way? Because I do. Um, okay, anime girls looking really, really cute. Adorbs anime girl. She's gonna be such soon. Um, it was good, thank you. I came here for the cozy, lovely Claire vibes. I was literally talking to us earlier about how much I can't wait for Stardew tomorrow and how i'm just super excited to get back into it i like i got my little boyfriend now and i'm just really excited for stardew like so excited i love playing it oh should i give her like some little glitter cheeks i don't want the line though oh i can't have the glitter without the line such oh my gosh how anime should i go with this girl because i have these <laughs> little cute like little face stripes Oh my gosh, she looks like Naruto! <laughs> what? Oh, bean cum! Oh my gosh, what? I'm so sorry. I have not been giving you guys the bean cum. Oh, sorry, I keep bringing up my boyfriend. Sorry about that. Bean cum, bean cum. She's here being a bean. Thank you so, so much for the hydrate there. Um, She's Drake's aunt. Who's Drake? Who is she? Who, what, 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 and who now? Whose aunt is she? I don't know who you mean. Um, check her family tree. Apparently she might be Draco's aunt. No. Oh no. Okay, we will check the family tree. <gasps> Thank you, Angelica Evil. I will check the family tree. Don't say that. Please don't say that she's Draco's aunt. I will do the biggest Saj ever. Um, I'm giving her the heart cheeks. What am I even thinking? Get those heart cheeks on her face right now. She's definitely a heart cheek kind of girl. There we go. Okay, please no. You were meant to be our romance. Don't do this to me. I'm even giving you a strawberry dress. Just don't do this to me, girl. Strawberry dress and everything. Don't do this to me. Look how cute you are! 
Okay, I'm gonna stop there then, because if she is, this has just ruined all of our plans. I love the heart cheeks on Minzy and how she just kept them her whole life. She's like, I am a heart queen and I'm, I will just accept that. Okay, let's check the family tree. If we can find her on the family tree, it is a big sudge. Um, I really hope she isn't. That would be very bad. Lolo, thank you so much for the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, a thousand bits, and a big, huge heart for you. And also, um, J Bib, thank you so much for subscribing. Is an Amazon Prime? You welcome J Bib to the peaches, please. Ashes, thank you so much for being here for two months with your Amazon Prime. LJ the King, thank you so much for the bits. I think violets looks good with brown eyes. I feel like they're undervalued. I actually do use brown eyes very, very often though. Um, oh, oh, we've lost power as the house. Not good. Not good. Can we pay the bills? I can't pay the bills. <gasps> Can I ask the world for money? Should I try it? I'll try it once. And if it works, we keep the well. If it doesn't, we get rid of the well. I'm going to give it $100. Oh, you're going to have to be fast with this. The good thing is he can bat around, so he's actually doesn't need to be outside for as long as everybody else. And then we're going to ask for simoleons and then get back inside. Okay, quick, do the do it and then get inside, Draco. Quick! Boom. And that's why Draco is more useful. And the coins have regurgitated in the well and straight into Draco's wallet. Wait, how much was that? <gasps> we got 7k! Okay, we keep in the well. We are keeping the well, guys. We are keeping the well. Okay, let's check this family tree and then I need to drink as well. Why are you about to age up? Oh, because you're still a teenager. I forgot about that. Okay, so you think it could be his aunt. So that must mean it's related to Ashton. <sighs> okay. No, 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 no. No. No! Uh, I don't think it is. I can't see her. She's not here. What can't you see? What what was hidden there? What was Beanie blocking? Was Beanie block- Oh, Beanie's blocking Draco. Okay, let me find a new home for the Bean. Where's the best place? You don't really get many notifications up here, right? I don't think. Yeah, I think this is the best place. Let's put Bean up here. Sorry about that, guys. Um, it went to 7k. So that was pretty good. Okay, Beanie can have some of my space. And I'm gonna just hide that little bean cum bit for now. There we go. Boom. Is that better? Hopefully that's better. A bit of bean cum is overflowing. So let me just put her back in. Back in you go. There we go. She's not overflowing now. Uh, check from her family tree just in case. How do I get to her family tree, though? Where is she? Yeah, it doesn't say that they're related at all. She's a bit older than him, but he's going to live forever. So I feel like age is a bit more relative and he's just about to become a young adult. So I think it's fine. Uh, I'm going to invite her around because I need to drink. Are you outside? Oh my gosh. What are you doing? Get inside. Idiot. Um, and I'm actually going to be nice and not kill her. I'm going to do a little gentle drink. A little gentle drink instead. And I need him to increase his fitness skill. So can you do some sit-ups or anything? No? Okay, Saj. Maybe they're cousins. If we move her in, we can take some of her money. Where are you going now? No, get back inside. Honestly, vampires are so hard to take care of. Oh my gosh, if he does that once more, he dies. Literally, he will die if he does that once more. I'm going to give him some indoor activities just to keep him entertained. And then his vampire energy is low, so I need to get him to meditate, right? Let's get him to do a meditation. Where has he gone now? This boy stresses me out. This boy stresses me out, man. Stresses me right out. There we go. Okay, we're meditating to get our energy back up again. Click on the... Oh! Yeah, you do. I used to do this with Connor, and somewhere along the way, I forgot the right way to do that. Okay, is my anime baby here? Where's she at? <gasps> She's here? She's 
Oh, what's she freaking out about? Oh, bees? Is she being attacked by bees? Yeah, anime girl's being attacked by bees. Um, okay. You do look very cute though. So why don't you, um, come inside? Where are you trying to go now? Let's go here together. Fly as a bat here together. Well, she can't do that, so. And then I'm just gonna do some numbs. I wanna taste her blood, see if she's tasty enough to be the child, the mother of our children, you know? It's a great start to her new life. I know, right? Go as you mean to, start as you mean to continue. Because look at her, she's in there like, ah, bats! And I'm like, ah, death. Death and destruction um, is in your future. So I'm just gonna uh, compel for a small drink. Just a little baby drink, because I am thirsty. Um, but this will be the first time he's ever drunk anyone without intending to kill them. Which I think, character development, character development light color change to purple to represent maya okay let me um go ahead and get my shoe look and we will do a purple light change there we go beautiful purple lighting and this music's kind of a bit like but there we go um are you gonna drink from her or not yeah you are this is the only human ever ever She's greedy. That's not gonna go well for you, babes. That we haven't tried to be evil to, which I think is pretty huge. He's talking about his mortal life to her. You didn't have one. You were born a vampire, so... Lies. He's telling her lies right now. And she's... He's talking nicely to her. This is so huge. Honestly, this is a really big moment. This is massive. Another good way to get your um, friendship up quicker is to... How do I do it? Take photos together. Where's that at? Um, entertainment. Take photos together. And she should be fine because we've only taken one drink. Yeah, she's a bit like confused looking. but And she's got a little bite mark on her neck now. Which does that stay there forever? When she's been bitten by a vampire, she's got tears in her eyes. Poor thing. Poor thing. Why is this actually cute? Because he's not immediately trying to kill her, which is just so sweet. And I was like, look, let's get a picture of your little bite mark on your neck. <laughs> look at the tears in her eyes. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, bless her. Oh, the poor thing. The poor thing. And yeah, we will make her cattle. Um, is it? Maybe I should woo woo. Where are you off now? Where are you going? Oh, you're off for a little sleep. Should I woo woo with her before I make a cattle or after? I don't know which is less messed up. Honestly, both of them are kind of bad. She's gonna be the next Riku. We should give her a little pink, cute, adorable maid outfit. We'll definitely give her before. Yeah, I think before is sweeter. I agree. I think before is nicer so that she's in love and then we hit her with the old, by the way, um, you are now mine forever. In the darkest possible way, because I, uh, if I die, you die. That's how being a cattle works. And can I not ask her about her attractive preferences? Violet is not compatible with Draco. What does that mean? I've never had that before. What? What does that mean? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Where do I see this? It's because he's a teen. How do I see his sexual preferences? Relationships. Um, woohoo. Woohoo. Um, oh my gosh, why can't I remember how to do this? How can I see what his sexual preferences are? Oh. Okay, I thought for a moment that Draco was gay, in which case we were gonna have to rework this whole thing. However, he's not. Ah, uh, teens and adults can't have relationships. He ages up today. Okay, maybe we should do a little birthday party today then, because today is the day that he ages up. And then I can see whether he finds her attractive or not. Okay, that, that is, that's good. That's good. 
Let's do that instead. I was like, if Draco was gay, how do I do this? Because how do I continue his line? That would have like, I would have had to rework the whole thing. But his preference is actually 100% female. So there we go. It has to be a young adult. Right, we're baking a cake for ourselves. Am I wearing dungarees? I'm actually wearing a dungaree dress. However, I never took off my low yoga leggings. <laughs> That's why today's outfit is a mishmash. So I still got my yoga pants on, but I've also got on this little <laughs> dungaree dress. So <laughs> it's kind of a lazy outfit. It's a lazy outfit. Um, da -da 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 -da. um Ve Venus Apollo. I think it would be really cool to have Maya turn into a human because of the sun. She turns golden haired and then she has to work. Just see to see what you think. Oops, let me put you guys back on the game. <laughs> Yeah, I really don't know what to do with Maya. I don't know what to do with Maya at all. I don't know what to do. Do you have to kill the girl if she has kids with Draco? Thank you for hydrate space kestrel. Um, no, we're gonna keep her alive as our cattle. That's what we're gonna do. Um, Jules, thank you so much for the bits. Oh, Jerity, thank you so much for subscribing using Amazon Prime. And also Laura and Kay. Thank you for subscribing using Amazon Prime. Welcome uh, both of you guys to the peaches. Please welcome them in the chat. Also, um, Harley Quind uh, Quindade, thank you so much for being here for two months with Amazon Prime. And um, Venus Apollo, thank you so much for the bits again. You are a favorite streamer YouTuber. I've watched you forever. I'm thinking maybe Maya turns into a human with golden hair because of the sun. And then she has to work around the house. Yeah, I'm gonna, um, ooh, let me add candles to this quickly. I might need your guys' suggestions. He's broken, by the way. Like, he's got this interaction stuck there. So I'm just going to reset him. There we go. Um, also, please just change into, like, some nice clothes for your birthday, please. Because <laughs> you always just walk around in the outfit. Oh, jeez. Um, yeah, let's pop you in this. There we go. There we go. I downloaded some cool new CC, by the way, that I'm going to show you guys in a moment. Um... Don't eat the cake. I know it looks really tasty, but please don't eat it. She's very cute, isn't she? She is very cute. Um, please add your little birthday candles. There you go. And now you are going to blow them out. If he wasn't evil at this point, he'd probably feel quite sad about the fact that he's blowing them out without any of the family that he grew up with. But he's got anime girl. Oh, wow. You're in full vampire mode right now. He's got anime girl that's like, for sure, he has some flowers. The cake matches her vibe, and he's just not aged up, has he? Wow, he just completely ignored me. Okay, looks like aging is broken again. Um, we need to invite over his friendos by the, his his half siblings so that they turn into vampires. I am gonna have to do set age. We're gonna make him a young adult. And uh, now we need to decide what his final trait is. So let me bring up the trait selector. Um, from this challenge. Let me try and find it again. Uh, Sims for Legacy Challenge. And we need to go to the trait generator. Random trait generator. Okay. Can we remember what his parents' traits were? If you guys can remember what his parents' traits are, I'm going to be so impressed. I need to know what his traits are to put into the, um, the thing. Um. Can I make it so you guys can see this? Capture specific window. Hmm. There we go. Okay, let me show you guys this for a moment. Oh. There we go. Okay, so this is the random trait generator that we're using. Um, both were evil and snob, and then the dad was a vegetarian. Okay, evil, snob, and oh, no, snob. And the dad was a vegetarian. What was um, Claudia? She was an evil snob as well, right? They were honestly made for each other. And then... Loner. Was she a loner? She was a loner. Wow, you guys are impressive. Well done. 
Um, the child traits. So he was evil. And he's also a snob too. So he's either probably going to be a loner or a vegetarian. <laughs> Being a vegetarian as a vampire is kind of a waste, but okay. Generate, wait. Yeah, generate child trait. That work? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Adult trait is loner. Okay, so he gets the loner trait as an adult. Would it give us a um Will it give us his like lifetime aspiration or anything? See if this works. Hmm, this page isn't working. Hmm. Oh. Well, oh, I don't want to do it again. But I have to. Give me one sec, sorry. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, there we go. I just wanted to- we don't really do lifetime aspirations on this, so it's not that important, but we'll do it anyway. Did the video come out? Did it actually process? I didn't think it would process. And then evil. And next trait, please. Okay, there we go. Evil and snob. And... Come on. There we go. Uh, loner. Generate child. This one doesn't, well, there we go, it does work. Um, generate traits. Loner. Joke star, really? <laughs> Joke star? Uh, it's definitely loner. Uh, and apparently joke star. Wait. No, he's aged up with Master Vampire. That makes more sense, right? Wait, he already had that from being a teenager. Ignore me. I just did all that for absolutely no reason. We'll just do it for traits because they're all vampires. So I feel like that makes sense. Um, Where is Lona? Am I just being blind? Lona. Lona, where are you? Lona, there we go. Okay. So Draco is aged up. He's taken his pants off again. Again. Um, so I'm just going to put his pants back on. <laughs> and then now that he's... Oh, he's passionate. From titillating banter. I'm from making... Okay. No, stop, stop taking your pants off. I, wa I wanted him to scope the room. Why did you always want to hibernate? You are the laziest vampire I have ever known. Okay, now... Oh, pet check, pet check, pet check, pet check, pet check. Yay! It's a Darcerino. Darcerino. You guys wanted a pet check? And you got a cut one, a bonus one. Stay in my arms for a sec. Stay here. Stay here. Oh, don't look on my desk. Stay here. Show everyone how cute you are and big and strong and beautiful and floofy and scratchy. Yes, you are. Ooh, 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 ooh. A baby Darcy, he is so biggy and such a baby. There we go. <gasps> and Pearson redeemed a snack time. Okay, 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 okay. Um, da -da 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 -da. right, snack time, guys. You know the rules. We got sixty seconds. I'm gonna pause the game because I feel like Anime Girl's gonna escape if we're not careful. She already escaped. You know why she escaped, Draco? Because you were taking your pants off. You were taking your pants off and you were getting into your coffin the whole time. Being lazy. Don't worry, we'll bring her back. She's, we'll bring her back for um, a romantic, beautiful day in our house with no furniture. Uh, and we're going to get snack time. Let me catch up with you guys real quick in the chat. Samantha Scano, thank you so much for the win. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One thousand bids. A big, big, huge heart for you. Beanie is a bit low. There we go. Also, uh, Tori Lean, thank you so much for subscribing. Can we welcome Tori Lean to the peaches? Also, Kristen, thank you so much for subscribing with your Amazon Prime. And oh, 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 oh. We got some bean movement. 
We got some bean shaped movement. Also, Samantha Scuttle, thank you so much for the win. See it. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wait. Yeah, a thousand bits again. That's two thousand bits. Samantha, thank you so, so much for that love and support. I appreciate you. Tori, thank you so much for the win. Two, three, four, five gifted subs. If you were just gifted by Tori, please make sure you say a big thank you in the chat. Uh, welcome to Squad New Peaches. Tori, thank you so much for the five. KG Cut, thank you so much for subscribing. And Luku, thank you both for subscribing using Amazon Prime. Can we welcome both of them to the Peaches, please? And Jordan, thank you so much for the bits. Just got some good news. I don't have to go to hospital because they were able to get me in for an x-ray for my abdomen. What? That is amazing. I'm excited and relieved. I have a fear of hospitals. and a I had a panic attack this morning when I thought about I have to go there again. Jordan, I'm so glad that we got that good news. I hope that the x-ray results go okay and that your tum tum starts to ease. And um, Puss and Boots, thank you so much for the win. 10, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 1,000 bits. Hey Claire, I've been a lurker for years. As an almost 30 year old like myself, I appreciate the things you do and the wholesome and safe community you've created. I'm in Texas and we are currently going through the worst freeze ever. Yes, I've read. Please stay safe, Puss and Boots, and thank you so much for the beautiful support and that is club that is club represent thank you so much for hanging out with me and ashberg thank you so so much for subscribing as well can we welcome ashberg to the peaches okay guys you know the rules and so do i it's snack time so 60 seconds run and get a snack i'm gonna do the same thing when you get back to the chat you've got to tell the chat what snack you've got you may find some snack buddies who have the same snack let's go three two one go Okay, I'm back. What did you guys get for your snack? Look what I've got. So, this is called a singu pear. A singu pear? A Korean pear. Look at it. I've never had one, but I heard that Korean pears taste different to English pears. So I wanted to try it. It's so, like, it's huge. Like, and it's circle. Has anyone had a Korean pear before? Are they good? Yeah! Korean pears are huge, but so good. Do I like shine it first? Like, should I wash it? I'm just wiping it on my dress. Like, do I cut it in half? How do I eat it? Do I just bite into it? I don't know what to do. I'm scared. Should I just bite into it? I'm just gonna bite into it. It looks- it's huge, isn't it? This is how it looks. You put it in your Korean barbecue. What, you don't just eat it normally? Can I eat it normally or not? Do I- can I just bite in there? Next Gen, thank you so much for subscribing. Can we welcome Next Gen to the Peaches, please? And also, Peachy Squad, thank you so, so much for the bits. I have a wipe on my desk. I can give it a wipe. Okay, I'm wiping it. <laughs> Smell the fruit, close the eyes, and munch. I'm giving it a wipe. That is nice and clean now. I think I'm taking its skin off doing this. <laughs> I 
Wait, I'll wash it. Fine. I never ever normally wash fruit. I always just bite into it. Um, but I, this one came all the way from China. So it's been on planes, trains and automobiles. So, <laughs> okay. Uh, there was a light change. What was the light change? It tastes like a pear. It's juicy. It tastes the same. I don't get it. Saffron's for the lights. Okay. There we go. Yellow lights. Yeah, I don't get it. It just tastes like a pear. I thought it would taste really different. But it tastes the same. It tastes just like a pear. Am I missing something? I don't get it. It tastes like how I remember pears tasting. Mm. Okay, I thought it would be totally different. I'm sorry, I hyped that pear up so much and it was not what I was expecting. Um, okay, I will turn move like a bat off so that he uses less energy. Um, that's a good shout. And then let's invite over Bay again. Um, invite her to hang out. Can I do another little... Oh, I can't. My energy is a bit low. Um, sleeping or using dark meditation. Okay, have a little, a little slack while we wait for her to come down. Bean cam needs to move down a little bit. Thank you. Uh, PG Squad, thank you so much for the bits. Hi, Claire. I just got on stream. What has happened so far? A lot. Um, we decided Draco will be the heir. And we are trying to make the next generation with Violet. Um, however, she has escaped our clutches so far. Also, I've realized I've just like brought back Maya. And then I have no idea what Maya's doing. Just staring at the wall. Okay, question, question, question. Maya's still thirsty even as a ghost. She's probably gonna end up killing um, our cute little anime girl if we're not careful. Should I release an, um, Maya's spirit if we're gonna go for Draco? Cause like, I'm gonna pull you guys. She will end up killing her cause she's thirsty even as like um, a ghost. So release her spirit or keep her around or Maybe try to revive her, but there's not that much point in her anymore because she's not the heir anymore. So I'm going to give you guys five minutes to make up your minds. Um, also, Regan, the Saltman, thank you so much for subscribing. He is an Amazon Prime. Welcome to the Peaches. And Sunshine Chloe, thank you so much for being here for two months in a row. Yeah, I kind of forgot about Maya and we could be in big trouble. Big trouble. Hmm. Yeah, straight away she wants to chat with Violet. This is why it's all very worrying. Also, um, Draco hates um, his sister. So, like, look, they hate each other. They're literally mortal enemies. So even the fact that she exists in the same household is going to constantly bum Draco out, which is quite annoying. It is quite annoying. Yeah, she died of sun exposure. I wonder if I should have just kept her dead. But yeah, she's constantly going to be around the house being all, like, dead and annoying and bumming Draco out. Which I don't love. She's also bumming out poor, um, poor little anime girl, too. And we're going to go ahead and try to continue this little romance. He's woken up really flirty. And he wants to schedule a day. And now I can see whether you find her attractive or not, can't I? Oh, 
Yes, you guys are totally right. Thank you. Let her go. Revive her and make her cattle. Oh my gosh, that would be messed up. I don't think you can do that with vampires, actually. Put some trousers on, man! What is wrong with you? Get dressed! You're meant to be like an heir. She's like, oh my gosh, put some pants on. Look, you're annoying her with your lack of care for trousers. Please just care more. Just care more. I like wavy hair. Oh no. Draco has the like the straightest slicked back hair I've ever seen. Maybe because she said I like wavy hair, he like immediately runs off and like changes his hair. That would be kind of cute. But he's also not about that life, is he? Because he wants to... He's evil, so... <laughs> There's no point hiding the fact that he's evil. Draco got the impression that Violet finds him quite attractive, making him wonder if he has the right idea. Okay, 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 okay. And as for him... She's basic. He thinks that she's basic, but basic will do when you're just trying to make babies, you know? Just trying to make babies. Sunshine Chloe, thank you so much for, for two months with your Amazon Prime. Love being part of this community. It never fails to make me smile. I love that. We're happy to make you smile. Sorry for I already read that. My brain sometimes likes to forget the last five minutes of my life. Yeah, humans are basic. That's all it is. What's this spook doing? I don't want to give you advice. Just keep being friendly. You don't even care about making friends. That's such a lie. Stop being here, being all annoying. <laughs> Compared to long lost love, this guy loves to pretend he had like a really long mortal life, but he didn't. <laughs> he was never mortal. He's always been a vampire. Oh, <gasps> first kiss. And she's trying to freak us out the whole time. Like, look, she's like, eh. But Draco actually just had his first little kiss. <laughs> first kiss. Yay. Oh, and we're doing little huggos as well. This is going really well. Oh my gosh, she's laying it on thick. Um, I'm going to kiss her again. Can we woo-woo into the coffin already? How my parent in level one? <laughs> oh, it's from looking after Maya because she's younger. Wow, look, they hate each other. They absolutely hate each other. Okay, are these guys? No. Was has that happened that quickly? No. I think they're also gonna do woo woos. Oh, I'll paint you. I'll paint you so we can remember your sacrifice for the vampire cause. And really, like, if this guy who never even wore trousers was like, would you like to come into my wooden coffin? Would you really just yeet yourself in? Oh. Sorry for zooming in on the coffin, but the noise. Did you guys know that vampires had their own, like, woo-woo track? What? I didn't know that. Kaylin Via, thank you so much for the bits. I'm so happy. Release her spirit. 50% of you guys were. Ooh, it was really close. It was really close. But 50% um, of you guys said release her spirit. 49% maybe revive her. Only 1% of you guys wanted to keep her around. Okay, I think we're going to have to release Maya. I feel big, Sarge. If she didn't still need to drink as a ghost, it wouldn't be as annoying. But the fact that she still has to drink as a ghost is super annoying. Oh, I'm sorry, Maya. We did really like you, but it's time for you to go. Um, Caleb B, thank you so much for the bits. I'm so happy you're live. It's early where I am. How long ago did we start playing? P.S. I have an accent like pasta. I love it when you do it. Oh my God, I love pasta's accent. She got the cutest accent. Can I still try for a baby? Okay, we're gonna have to do, we're gonna have to. Draco, it doesn't usually happen in one go, babes. You gotta get out the coffin, Draco. You gotta give it a few goes. You gotta give it a few goes, okay? And maybe I should ask her to move in with me. What's your family's financial situation? That's what I need to know. If you've picked a poor heir that we don't get much money from, that's gonna be really annoying. I I'm gonna ask her to move in if I can. Boom. After we've wooed, we're gonna try. And a hydrate, thank you. 
Maybe they can see if they can do a vampire duel first. Moving in together. Oh, okay. Okay, they don't have much money. Maybe I should give them Maya and she can kill them all. Maybe that can be a nice thing I do for her. We can swap, you guys can have Maya. I'll take Violet. Take it all. <gasps> and leave them with nothing. Should I just take it all? Should I move Maya in? It could be a nice parting gift. That way, Maya still exists. And she gets to eat all this family. I think that's nice for her. You, you make my day so much better. Thank you for making me smile. <gasps> this is so sweet. He's going to be horrible to her going forward. I just know he is, but... That would be such a Draco thing to do. He's like, I am in control now. You bossed me around the whole time when you thought you were the heir, but I'm the heir now. And you are going over there and I'm taking my anime girl with me. And yeah, should we do that? Harvest them! Maya's like, yes! I will kill all of them, even the toddlers. Boom. Am I going with my- It sent me with Maya, hasn't it? It sent me with Maya. Hi, Mango. It sent- it's, I, I, I'm not the active family anymore, am I? <laughs> it sent me to those, those other guys. It's fine, I'll use Maya to kill some of them straight away. Lucifer stays with us. Lucifer stays with us. Okay, here she is. She's like, okay, apparently I'm moving in with you guys. And also... Wait, where is she? Where are you? Oh, she's not here. Let me bring her here. And also, just to warn you guys, I'm a vampire and I'm thirsty. This poor family, like, what have they got themselves into? Look how sweet and nice they all look with their little toddlers. And we have just, oh, it's the death dance. Boogie nights, boogie nights, I'm going to die now. Boogie nights to a vampire. And then, yeah, look what we've just unleashed. Death and destruction everywhere. Big, you know, do, 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 do. I love the death dance. I don't know why they do it. <gasps> you monster! Get off him! As soon as I'm thirsty again, babes, you're next. You, my friendo, are next. She's like, ooh, that was so delicious. When you age up, we'll drink you and kill you as well. And she's straight back to work. Efficient queen. Efficient queen. Oh, look, they've got a little, like, play area and everything. Oh, this family is so into their children. I have never made a kid's play area in their living room. I always like hide it off away somewhere. Oh, guys. I'm sorry. Steal all the furniture and move Maya back in. Nah, she, she stays here now and numbs and all the family. I've just realized I'm killing all of Anime Girl's family, but... Oh, well. <laughs> That is how you, uh... No, you like death. Death is an old friend. Death is quite literally an old friend. Stop make letting death get you down. Um, that is a good introduction to the family. That is what we do. So, you know. Brilliant. Okay, thank you. Let's go back to our other family. YOLO. Yeah, indeed. Maya died, so she might not like death right now. Yeah, but she still exists on, on the mortal plane, you know? Uh, where was that family gone? I kind of- I'm gonna leave Maya to do her own thing. And just see what crack she gets up to, because I think that's quite fun. 
So I will set those guys to uh, unplayed. Have fun! And Draco holding the cat there instead of his potentially pregnant girlfriend. Interesting. Let's head back to these guys. Boom. Oh, we can check We can check our family tree now. We can check our family tree now. Do we know for sure that those toddlers aren't violets? I didn't even think about that. What? Oh my gosh. Kayla B, thank you so much for gifting a sub. Welcome to Gunny PG. Please make sure you say thank you to Kayla in the chat. Also, LJ the King, thank you so much for the bids. Maybe check to see if um, they can have a vampire. Oh, I totally forgot to do that, LJ. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, okay. Um, shall I get her to do a... Where's the little human room? A pregnancy test? I don't... I think it's really hard for my sims to get pregnant. Oh, yep. Yeah, immediately sees, like, Saj because someone in the family has died. <laughs> I don't know who I just killed and what relation they were to you. She does want a woo-woo again. Oh! <gasps> She's pregnant! She's pregnant, guys! The next generation is soon to be upon us. She's gonna go in and tell Draco. She's like, um, Draco, good news. Uh, this is her voice, apparently. Um, we, we're expecting another child. Another little human baby. And Draco's like, mm, about that. <gasps> what? Can I not make her my cattle then? Once she's had the baby, we'll make her cattle. We can't do it until then. And he's like, okay, great. Here's my bed. That's yours. Good night. <laughs> Um, okay, let's check out her family tree. Okay, so I just killed her brother. The good news is, though, she doesn't have any children or any relation to us. Yeah, and that's her brother that I killed. I wonder how many she'll get through. Oh, he did have babies, though. He had two babies. He had two babies. So, yeah, that, that was a thing that happened. But no other babies, and she's not related to us, so... Yeah, Taz, you just returned to the pregnancy! Um, yeah, we've got um, anime girls having our baby. What is her attraction to Draco? Let's find out. She finds him attractive. She does find him attractive, so that's good. Um, she also notes that he's unemployed. <gasps> what career should we get him? What should Draco do? He's good at painting? What career should I give him, guys? I totally forgot that I need to get him a job now. <gasps> you missed a mini workout. Okay, while those guys are sleeping, let us do ourselves a mini workout. Grab your weights. This time we're going up 20 reps. This time we are counting in Sino. Um, give me a sec. I've got pear juice on my phone. So let's do this. Three, two, one, go. Um, il, e, sam, sa, o, yuk, chill. Wait, did I do it wrong last time? No, I didn't. Pal, uh, gu, shiv, shivel, shivy, shivsam, shivsa, shivo, shivyuk, shivchil, shiv. Pal, every time! Uh, chivgu and each. Wait, yeah, each. Each. Boom. Yeah. 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 Hey, back. There we go. Don't fall off this time. Awesome. Okay. So we've had a bit. We are pregnant. The next generation is on its way. You guys would like to do freelance painter. Then you can work when you need the money. The thing is, I often need the money. So I'm wondering if we should do it as a career one. Maybe a critic because he's already so good at painting. Yeah. Okay. We'll get him on. Let's uh, find ourselves a job. And, ooh. Combat in a cold. Really? And he wants to move again. <laughs> I'm, I'm one. Oh, she's an art critic. No freaking way. She's an art critic, guys. What? How wild is that? Oh my gosh. I think he should be a painter. What? Check anime girl's mom. I think she's related to Draco's dad. Don't. 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 Oh no, she's not. She's not related to anyone. Nancy Medley. She's not related to anyone, don't worry. No, she's not. 
We're all good, guys. Don't worry. It's not weird. We're all good. Um, and I should probably get him painting, right? Why don't we do ourselves? We like to do classic paintings, don't we? There we go. Wait, why don't you do a flirty painting? Oh, he's already started. Okay, fine. If he stays flirty, I'll get him to do a flirty painting because I want to see what he paints. Oh, who's that? Oh! <gasps> I thought that they didn't get ghosts. I thought they didn't get ghosts. Oh, is she back? Even in death, she can't escape the mother. What? Oh my gosh, what? <laughs> no freaking way. Oh my gosh, Amy Adele, can you wish me luck on the exams next? What? Wait. Where did she just go? Where did she just go? I don't know what just happened, but that was hilarious. Um, can you wish me good luck on my exams next week? I can't, I can't, I can't. I use your videos to de-stress from studying. Emily, you got this. Sending you good luck vibes for your exams. Study hard, my love. Uh, she's like, you thought I was gone. Exactly. Um, also, Kyra, thank you so much, Minnie, for seven months. Wait, that's seven, that's four. Seven months, slowly but surely getting to two years. What? And LJ the King, thank you so much for the bits. Here's an idea. Maya goes to the vampire mansion after killing the whole family, expecting to be revived and just on his air. Then Draco duels her, hopefully wins, and then releases her spirit. The thing is, though, what if, what if she wins? Then what will she do? She'd probably kill Draco's child. Wait, I've got 35,000 pounds. Okay, 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 okay. Hot pause, hot pause. Uh, first, the first thing I'm gonna do is get my boy a nicer coffin. Cause let's face it, the guy spends so much time in one that he deserves a better one. He deserves a better one. Um, also, she should sell the house and bring some money back from it. Basically, I just want to see a vampire jewel and give you bits. LJ, that's so sweet. Thank you. Um, I'm so sorry I missed out on the jewel. I actually should have done the jewel because that would have been fun. Um, wait, what's the other one called? How do I get their, um... Is it in beds? Where is their, like, fancy one? I just want him to have a nice one. Is this the fanciest one? No, this is the fanciest one. Okay, I'll go up one. Because we don't have that much money. But I will at least give you a nicer one to sleep in. And then maybe I'll actually give you a bedroom at some point. Maybe, maybe so. Okay, let's make it daytime so I can do some buildies. Right, so the front of the house is looking kind of vibey. This is like an outdoorsy bit. You come up the stairs, and we were trying to work out what to do here, weren't we? Like, how to make this like a bigger staircase. And we were suggesting maybe like... Oh, oh, this has no ceiling. Okay, whatever, it's fine. Um, let me just see what happens if I do this. Oh, fine, just don't do any of the middle bit. Make an actual living room that is called an unliving room. Oh my gosh, I love that. Love that. And Tay Tay, thank you so much for the bits. LJ the King, you should get Draco a better coffee. I did it, I did it, I did it. And Kamala, thank you so much for the bids. The frugal reward trait will reduce household bills and the marketable reward trait will increase the value of his paintings. I think the marketable is a good shout. I will definitely do that. I don't know if the frugal one is a bit like, is that cheesy? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so you come up these stairs here. Does that, if I go in one, will that delete the stairs? No, okay. So you come up these stairs. Um, my brain is trying to like work this out. Um, there's a bedroom here and a bedroom here. This is like the outdoor a little bit. And then I, do I even need another floor to this house? Maybe a lookout tower? I don't know. I don't know what to do there. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> Open the space next to the stairs and you can hang a gigantic chandelier. But then how do I access the balcony? Yeah, a gigantic chandelier would be very vibey. Okay, let me just try that. Um... I guess I'd do this, right? And then I can delete that. 
Yeah, and it won't delete the bits to the side. So they can still like walk along the top kind of thing. Yeah, a vibey chandelier is a good shout. Okay, let's find one. I think a pointy vampire vibe roof is all that you need now. Should I go up another floor or not? This was the thing. I don't know. The balcony isn't even. Oh my gosh, what? What even happened to this balcony? I swear I finished this. Why did it go all weird? Yeah, the balcony isn't even. But I can't work out why. Should this go like... Wait, why is that? Okay, br my brain is fully confused right now. Because that's this, that's right. And then that goes there. And then... This... Ah... Uh, is that even? Yeah, that's even. So then that needs to go. And then, how should this bit go? That still isn't even though. Oh. Ah, that's better, right? Wow, I, w I would not have noticed that. How bad is that? Total Sims Pro here. <gasps> Total Sims Pro. <gasps> the archways aren't even. What do you mean? Oh. Wait, is that one that's wrong? There. Okay, so that's looking a lot better. Um, big vibey chandelier was next on the list, so let's get that done. That is a f that's the fans, Claire. <laughs> uh, lighting. We need a big vibey chandelier. What about the vampire one? It's not very big though. Hmm. But 35k, that poor family, we just like took all their money and then also killed them all. <laughs> the poor things, they didn't deserve this. I'm wondering whether to like extend that forward a little bit. Like how does that look from the floor below? Let me just do a little check. Like what do you see? Does that look cool? Oh, that's quite cool, right? I hate the, the the fact that the ceilings are white is so annoying. I think it's gonna block them. I can I can build test it afterwards. I'm just gonna sort out that. Yeah, there we go. And then, do we have some balcony to steal? Yeah, I do. Oh no, don't do that. Just let me free build it. What am I doing? No. There we go. There we go. What are these little stupid white lines? Where have they come from? Why are they just floating there? What is that? Why is it doing that? I don't know what that is. That's really annoying, but oh well. You'd bang your head on it. Yeah, bring it, move it forward a bit. What I think I might have to do is actually give up a little bit of this balcony to be open space. Because um, I think you want to be able to actually see that chandelier from below. So like that. Because then you'd actually be able to see it from the floor below, which I think would be way cooler. So like that. Oh, where am I off? Okay. 
Sorry, took a bit of a detour. Yeah, that's better. Which means we can't have that glass bit there, because, like, what would the chandelier be holding on to? That would be kind of low-key nonsense. Unless it's got a special chain that goes all the way to the top of here. We could pretend that. Can you press G? Yeah. Okay. And then, so you come upstairs, and then the bedrooms are going to be up here. So let's get, like, a vibey vampire door. Yes! Is that a bit much for, for inside? What have I got on the front door? Hmm. Eh, can it really be too much in a vampire va mansion? I don't know. I could always go for the, like, the... Hmm. I, I don't want to go small, though. I want it to stay vampire-y and vibey. Won't they burn? We shall find out, but so far they haven't. So I feel like it's kind of safe. I don't know. Railing at the back of the stairs. Yes, that is a good shout. I will do that. I like the black doors because they're creepy and edgy. And this would actually be moved back a bit, I think. Just because I don't like how hemmed in it feels otherwise. There we go. And let's grab this and pop it here. Here we go. Vibes! Okay, so... Um, vampires don't need to use the bathroom. So would I even build a bathroom in my... Would, I, would you even need an ensuite? You probably wouldn't. You honestly probably wouldn't. Would you even need a bed? I guess at least now he's got the option of what he wants to sleep in, you know? Draco's colour's green, right? No. Did we change his colour to red? Is he red or green? They, they do bathe. Oh, that's true. That's true. I can't remember what his colour was. I'm trying to think. Oh, would you want your bed face in the windows? The thing is, I can't make, I can't get this bed in green, which is very annoying, because that is Draco's vibe. But I can't get it in green. I guess I could do grey and green together. Um, BTS Luna, thank you so much for the bits. He is an artist. She's an art critic. Will their love survive their egos? I love that. LJ the King, thank you so much for the bits. You should, my, um, my name should be LJT the King. Ah, it's my initials, but I didn't do cups. I'm changing it to something different anyway. Your name is Liam. If you can't remember that, that's, it's okay if you can't. Thank you for letting me know though. Miss Redhead, thank you so much for subscribing. We welcome Miss Redhead to the peaches, please. And also Peachy Lily, thank you so much for for six months with Amazon Prime. Hope you have an amazing day. Hope you are as well. The Sim Cat, thank you so much for being here for two months. And also Dylan Riley's been here for two months. Appreciate that, guys. Don't forget doors to the balcony. Yeah, I'm going to put the bed right at the back of the room. Um, because I think having it by the windows would actually be a big stress as a vampire. And then I'm going to put the coffin at the end of the bed like so. Just so that it's kind of like they go together. And then this bit here I will do as like a bathroom area. Um... I could do like black and red bathroom or I could do the wings one, which is more Draco style. Which would he use to bathe? Light color to pink for violet. I love their color combo. Okay, okay, okay. Let's do some pastel vibes for anime girl. There we go. Pretty, very pretty. The wings! Oh yeah, because he's got a bat form. That is such a good point. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna put like a candle and stuff behind it. And then I'll do the matching... Is there a wings toilet? Is there a toilet that goes with that? The swan. What pack are you from? Yeah, it's gotta be this one then. Um, and I'll do like a little half wall just for privacy. How can I best do this?
There we go. Also allows me to put stuff against the walls, which I think is a bit easier. I can put like a little sink there. Should the garden get changed into a playroom for the baby? I don't know how much you'd care. <laughs> he is still um, Draco and I don't know how much he cares. Oh, by the way, would they even have a mirror above their sink? Because it's not like they have a reflection, is it? All of these interesting little quirks that you have as a vampire. They don't have reflections. Which is kind of interesting. Um, but would you just get more like used to things being a certain way? I don't know. Mirror behind it like that? Is that kind of weird or fun? I need some lights in here. I can't see anything. Um, what am I doing? Here we go. Lighting! And... Yes. Oh my gosh, yes. This is good. This is good, strong. Oh, that, that's like right above his bed. Maybe I'll move it forward a little bit. Very Draco vibes here. With the big thing. And then I'll put some like, little sconces at the side of his bed. I could turn her... But I don't know if, like, I just don't know if he would. I genuinely just don't know if he, like, cares enough. Like, we're all here trying to romanticize Draco, but the boy's evil. He's evil too. He's no different to any of the rest of them. So we need to be careful not to fall into the... Oh, was that toilet 5k? Go a bit cheaper, please. Yeah, but it's his first time he's ever had a room in his whole life. I kind of want to spoil him a little bit. I do just want to spoil him a little bit. He deserves this, you know? He's had a real tough time. Um, plus, he's a selfish vampire, so I feel like he would um, definitely do things like this. Just spider webs. Oh my gosh, no. Yes. Okay, strong Draco energy. Strong Draco energy. And then we'll put some tiles in the bathroom. Um... The lights aren't even... What do you mean? What do you mean? What's wrong with the lights? The whole family died in one episode. They did. <laughs> Male vampires, even the mean ones, do like themselves some Vampire Bride. Even if just for show. I could do Liam. I just... I, at the beginning, I always said that... I don't know. But then maybe he's a bit lonely. But I... I don't want too many people in the household, you know? That's my other worry. Because if we're trying to keep a bunch of generations alive, I'm gonna run out of room in my household space. So that's why I initially wanted to just immediately kill. Like, as soon as I added them to the household, I just wanted to kill them. Because otherwise they were just taking up space in my household. I can't find anything that works there, so we're just gonna go with that instead. What do you like about my lights? Are they not- uh, oh, is it because one's higher than the other? They're, they're pretty similar. Remember toilet roll? Oh my gosh, yeah. Taz will tell me off. Let's get into a little toilet roll. A little loo roll. Where is the loo roll? Loo roll. Hey? Eh? Ooh. Yes, for this tall rock. Thank you, Taz. I can't find it, though, so the chance of me putting it there are getting slimmer and slimmer by the second. If it doesn't show itself in the next two seconds, I'm not putting it in. He doesn't even use the toilet. Would he remember to buy loo roll? I, I forget to buy loo roll, and I'm human, you know? Where is it? Seriously, where is it? I can't see it. Here it is. Uh, there we go. Little Lou roll that he'll never use because he can't use the toilet. And uh, we are starting to run out man, man, money. Man, 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 man. Uh, let me just get him a nice green rug. Nice green rug. Something very Polish. Is that army? No, he would not do that. 
Um, Princess Cordelia Rook. Nice big rug. Oh, I can't grab it now. Uh, let's make it thick. Okay. And then this is just going to be like a little seating area, I feel like. The floor reminds me of the first night in Bridgerton. <gasps> oh, Bridgerton! I really want season two. I like just like sometimes nonsense escapism shows and that one definitely fit the bill. And oh my gosh, you would totally cover the windows because you're a vampire. Can I get- can I get even- yeah. Oh, all that beautiful light is just instantly wicked away because he can't, he's a vampire. If he has light, he will burn. So no lights. No lights, I'm afraid. And then we need some Polish chairs. Nice Polish chairs. Oh, why can't I get that? Oh, I'm not in the right career. Oh, here we go. Yes. Polish chairs. And I don't know why it's dad talking like pasta. Um, and then a little table too. A little table. Hmm, none, none of you guys are the right colour. Maybe we just go black. Yeah, there we go. Oof. And then some candlesticks as well. I can't put plants in here because they'd all die. Yeah, his colour's green. I don't like that rug very much though. I don't love the rug. Um, some of his paintings I could decorate this wall with over time. Let me find a better rug. All the green ones are kind of trash. These are too modern. This one will do actually. Oh, this covers his whole room. Oh, don't freeze. There we go. Oh, it's too big. Oh, it's too big, which is a shame because it would have been pretty good, but we'll just put it there like that. And some bedside tables. Where is all this? Oh, thank you for the Porsche check, Lily. Uh, Kirsten, thank you so, so much for the went to 300 bits. Thank you so much for joining the stream. I'm glad you like this challenge. Kira, oh, Sierra, Sierra, Kira, Kira, thank you so much for subscribing. Isn't it always awesome prime? Welcome, Kira, to the peaches. Lynn, thank you so much for gifting a sub. Welcome, uh, new peachy. Make sure you say thank you in the chat to Lynn. And Dylan, thank you so much for being here for two months in a row. The Sims Cat's also been here for two months in a row. And Peachy Lily has been here for six months. Hope you have an amazing day as well. Liam, thank you so much for the bids. This might sound far fetched, but could you turn Anima Girl into a vampire? Have Vampire Jula out of spite and kill it if she wins. If Maya loses, then you could still say Violet got fatally wounded and dies, and that takes care of the problem. Then Jacob gets angry and releases Maya's spirit. That could actually be that. That could work. That could work. That is a lot of effort, but it could work. It could work. Can you decorate the unliving room? Yes. Let me just give him some bedside tables. All of which are massive in this game, for what reason, I do not know. There we go. Okay, his room's very green. I will be adding um, paintings all along this wall, but I'm starting to run out of money. So I think we should focus a little bit more down here. We can actually start to get some of our bookcases back. That one Object is currently locked. Oh. BB unlock career object. Oh my gosh, what is it, guys? Oh, where's Bean? She's gone. What's the cheat to get career objects? No more hydrate redemptions, I'm afraid, guys. I've drank everything. Player unlocks entitlement. Uh, player. Unlock send title. Is that spot right? Can I get it now? No. <laughs> um, ignore game. Oh, I missed the beginning bit. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Right, let's see if we can do it now. Boom. Thank you. Okay, so let's get back this little hexagon thing. Is that just a baseball bat? Oh yeah, we got that from the, the career job. To, <laughs> the criminal job, I forgot about that. Can I put that there? Hangs off a little bit. That's annoying. I've budge you over. Budge you over. 
That's better. Yeah, I just wanted, you know those places where you go in the libraries are like just these epic libraries that just cover the whole wall? I wanted those kind of vibes just because I thought it would be quite cool. And then that's also where the secret basement is. And for some reason there's like one tile here that's different to all the other tiles. But I can't get it. Really annoying. I don't know why it's just there. <laughs> Whatever, okay. So, um, we should get some nice chairs and stuff. I don't know if I'm going to be able to afford this, but I will try. Uh, yeah, guys, please don't post not so berry spoilers because not everyone's been to go watch it yet. So, um, please don't ruin it for people that haven't watched it yet. Oh, hello, gothic love seat. You are an absolute treat to the eyes. I love you. You are way too happy. Any more of this cool... Uh, let's, let's get some more vampire stuff from the vampires pack. Because uh, I like the stuff in that pack. Looks really cute. There we go. Oh, ooh, look at this thrill of the chaise. Love that. Oh. Just sprawl you out by the window. And then... I need like some of these kinds of chairs. Oh, you've only got those. Boo. No, no, no one of those. And no tables. Oh, fireplace. Oh my gosh, I forgot about the fireplace. We can put it back in. Yay, we can actually have a fireplace again. And my money is tragic. I think we're going to have to finish there. I don't think we can spend any more. I think we're all spent up. Oh my gosh. Okay, there is one final thing I want to get. Oh, I don't like how that is. I know that the thing is in the middle, but I'm actually going to put the fireplace inside to one side because otherwise it just feels too squishy. I'm also going to delete that and we'll, we'll put two small chairs at either side because I just think it's better. Um, so let me show you guys this thing that I downloaded. Um, okay, check this out. This is from... In... Uh, in jellies on uh, TSM, The Sims something, I don't know. But it's like, um, it works as a PC, but it looks like a old school like scribes. There's a few of them. So look, here is one. So they'll be able to use TV functions, but it will look more like it's meant to go in the house. How freaking cool is that? Um, that's this one too. I think that one's got the right energy for this house. And now they can basically use what is a PC, but it's going to look like this. How cool is that? Right, I have to sort this out because it's driving me absolutely mad. For some reason, it thinks this part, this is like separate to everything else. So I think I need to just drop it down. We should delete one wall so I can spy on it. There. Is it all the same height now? How, how do I... What is this little... Is it too low now? I can't work out what's going on here. It's too low, I think. Is it? Is it actually that it's too low? Let me try bringing it up. No, it's higher. Okay, that worked. So we'll just do that instead. Okay, and then I'm going to put this scribe in the corner here. Boom. And you can use this like a PC. So it basically acts as a PC, which I thought was really cool. Um, but it's like a scribe. So vibes. Very cool vibes. I'm going to make it stand out a bit just because it's pretty. Did it come with a chair? Bard's archive. Oh! <gasps> Oh my gosh, yes. That's a gothic one. Uh, oh, this one. Oh, yes. Let's do that. Oops. And can I get it in green? No, I can get it in black though. <gasps> and that will act as a PC so I can write books and stuff. I can write books and stuff on there, which I think is really cool. And oh my gosh, I got loads of stuff in my inventory. Uh, can I sell this? Yeah, I can. 
Um, some of these that I definitely don't need anymore. Frog we can breed, so I'll keep that. And then I'm just gonna sell some of these books, cause like, lol. Uh, vampire volumes I will keep though, we can't let those secrets come out. All of the little garden shoots. Such. You got this from work, your little lifeguard thing. <laughs> Should I put it in the bathroom, ironically? Let's do it. We'll hide it here so no one can see. Um, there's little Draco's sense of humor. We will sell that. Oh, I killed an alien. <gasps> Ooh, you will be a great new addition to the garden. Oh, what? You don't have an alien form in the garden? Rude, whatever. Sell those. Wait, just sell everything. All of them. Okay, no, fine. Have to do it like this instead. One bookcase is lower than the others. Okay, I will give that a go. And we've got loads of pictures here, but we're not really into keeping like ghosty things. So I, I will move this inside though. Bibbidi bobbidi boo. And I, w I do want to put two of those, but actually now I'm looking at it, I think with the shades it's a bit much. Maybe the shades should come in a little bit. I don't know, furniture's hard. This is all quite strangely sized furniture, so it's kind of hard to place. But I, I don't think I can spend any more now anyway. Um. So yeah, you now have a cool bedroom. However, we need to finance this. What do you need to do as part of your job? Create paintings. So I guess just... Oh, <gasps> yeah, flirty painting. We wanted to see a flirty painting, didn't we? And I can get him to use his bath, his cool wings bath. I do want to kill a spellcaster. We should try and kill every type of like thing, shouldn't we? <laughs> um, Corpse Kitten, thank you so much for being here for five months. Hope you've had a good five months. So happy to have you in this community to keep me sane during these crazy times. Lots of love. Thank you so much. We like you being here, Corpse Kitten. The roof. Oh. Oh, it's all covered. I know things are a bit strange, right? Oh, that bit's not covered. Okay. Uh, how do I cover this little bit here? Can I just like drag this over maybe? Okay, there. Now everything is at least covered. We'll decide what to do with the rest of it when we've got a little bit more money. But at least we have one bedroom and I will actually allow her. We're being nice to her right up until the point where we've got what we need, which is our baby. I will allow her to go and sleep in the nice bed. Oh, she can't get there. Okay, what's we'll have to find out what's stopping her. Okay, so can you get here? Can I not make you go to a platform? Can you get to can you go here? Oh! I know what we did. There we go. That's what we did wrong. Okay, there we go. There we go. <gasps> we oh, Beena's left the chart. Oh, Beena's really left the chart. She's not here near anymore. I'll put it on her bed just in case she comes back though. Uh, we got a hype train. Woo uh, got Ron, thank you so much for triggering the hype train by uh, subscribing to us on Amazon Prime. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We welcome Got Ron to the peaches, please. Can we get some hype in the chart? Uh, Liam says, I feel like Draco would find uh, a way to have a spellcast he can call up on to force make potions. I love the amount of lore you're going into with this guy. I love that. I love it. And Tay Tay, thank you so much for the win. 200 bits there. I appreciate that so, so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yay, hype in the chat. I'm going to close my window because my feet are freezing. Freezing. Oh, there we go. Okay, let's see if she can go upstairs now. No, she still can't go up. Can you go here? Can you go here? Okay, why can't you go here? Do you think it's the light? I reckon it's the light, isn't it? Um, let me just put that in my inventory for one second and see if she can get up now. Oops. No. Why can't she get up? She can't even go there. What is blocking her? I can't work out what it is. Only Draco would be able to get upstairs because he can turn into a bar. It makes no sense. Like, it looks perfectly achievable to me. 
If you get there, can you go there? No, she's just stuck on this platform. I don't get it. Very annoying. Um, I feel like we checked this before and it worked. She can walk around the platform. But she can't get up and down it. Hmm. Guys, I don't understand. I don't understand. What is causing this? It's the fence. Is there a fence? I'm going to put the, the chandelier back because it wasn't the chandelier. So let me just put that back because I, I can't actually see what I'm trying to do. So let's put this nice big chunky chandelier back in. And then what is causing it? I don't get it. it. It all looks perfect. It's a functional stairs. You guys are saying the platform's too high. Um, I'll drop it down to. See if that works. But the platform like should work fine as long as you can walk up to it. Oh, she's all. Why did it put her all the way out there? Like, I don't get that. Why even make platforms be available to go up that high if they won't work? Oh, now she can't do that. Um, okay, let me just move this down one. Oh, sorry, up one. So those stairs shift back a little bit. Let me see if she can use these bottom stairs. Okay, she can use that just fine. That works. Can you go here? But why? Claire, stairs like this are glitched now. Since when? No, I hate that. Um, So these stairs just won't ever work. Should I try just like removing it and then placing it again? Let me just see if she can use that. There is an invisible fence. Ah. So maybe if I like draw the fence and then remove it, will that work? Where is the fence? Oh, look, I can't see the fence. Where is it? Where is it just placed, that fence? I am so confused.com right now. There's apparently a fence there, but I can't see it. And I can't draw a fence myself. Control while I draw. Where's like the delete fence ball tool? It's because we destroyed the floor to have an open staircase. When the stairs are in front of the fence, it doesn't show the fence. Get rid of all the fencing. Get rid of the extra railing on the platform and move the stairs back one. This. This back bit, get rid of that. And then move the stairs back one. Okay, let's see if she can get up here. Oh my gosh, okay, so she can get up there. Let me do, let me move the stairs back one on the other side too. And then grab these stairs and then do them on this floor too. Is that right? Yeah. Oh, we can see the top step now. Did you guys notice that we couldn't see the top step before? And then because they can get up, I'm gonna see if it lets me put the, like, the staircase, these there now. 
because I think now they should be able to use them. And then let me just paint these staircases again because they look ugly right now. Um, okay, let's see if that works. Yay! Okay, wait, she's using an umbrella inside. Okay. <laughs> um, right. Um, so the roof doesn't work. I need to place... Wait. Let me try one thing. Let me just move this for a hot sec. Just move you here. And then let me just put a room completely over where that roof is. Just so that I can get like a floor there. Okay, done. And then I'll delete that. Is there still like a piece of, oh, I don't think it matters though, does it? Um, I always try and grab the wall and it just never works. Okay, and then I can put this back. And, oh, I've put it back wrong. This is the biggest pain to place. There. And I don't think it will be light underneath it anymore. I know it is. Oh, no, look. It takes it out for a little bit, but not all of it. This doesn't really work, does it? It's a nice idea and it looks cool, but it doesn't actually work. So I'm just going to, I'm just going to delete that, I think. Yeah, I think the best thing to do is just delete it. Oh, Sarge. It would have been nice, but I just don't think it's going to work. And then we'll just delete that. And now at least they're not using the umbrella inside, which was really annoying. So, hope like, let's see if she puts... Oh, well. I don't know how that made its way up there. Let's see if she puts her umbrella down. Like, it shouldn't be getting rained on here. There's no rain, is there? Yeah, there's a complete ceiling. I don't know where my chandelier is gone. Oh, it's still there's still the light there. Okay, there. We got things working, guys. We got there in the end. It was a bit of pain, but we got there. I can try out the bathroom and she can use the bed. Boom! Okay. Sorry about that. Sorry, I need to catch up on you guys in the chat. Thank you for everyone that supported the hype train. Um, 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 Rose Wolf, thank you so much for gifting a sub. Welcome to Squad New PG. Please make sure I say thank you to Rose. Bree Bree, thank you so much for the win. 200 bits. Also, Spring Smidge for the win. 200 bits. You guys feel the hype train. Woo woo. Shiny Mana Trick. Thank you so much for gifting a sub. <gasps> Welcome to the squad at New Peachy. Make sure you say thank you to Shiny in the chat. Also, Angel Face. Thank you so much for the bits. Woo woo. Come, CC. Thank you so much for the win. Two, three, four, five hundred bits to fuel the hype train. Woo woo. Bree Bree. Thank you so much for the win. Two, three hundred bits to fuel the hype train. Woo woo. And Junvi. Thank you so much for the win. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That is a thousand bits to fuel the hype train. Woo woo. Thank you so much, Junvi. Edgar the Gamer. Um, Claire Four Guys is coming to Xbox and Nintendo Switch. Please play. It again oh that's really cool that's such a cool um nintendo switch game thank you for the bits woo -woo. and megan megan kettering thank you so much for the bits as well woo -woo. i've been watching you since dreamhouse wanted to say thank you for helping me through some hard times and being one of my favorite youtube creators for so long keep up the amazing work thank you so much megan Kristen, thank you so much for the win two three four five friendship bits to fuel the hype train woo -woo. also uh crystal crystal uh Crystal, yeah, Crystal B, thank you so much for subscribing to this Amazon Prime. We welcome Crystal to the peaches. Uh, Kak, uh, Kak. Cacti, thank you so much for the bits. Woo -woo. I love you, not so berry challenge. I'm in your Sims the Elders. If you rotate them um, and go to the upper back, you can change how their back is arched. I never knew that. That's such a good tip. Thank you so much. Uh, to, uh, Liam, thank you so much for the bits. Don't look a gift off in the mouse. This is Draco's way of keeping the silly humans out of its room. And also, Jumpy, thank you so much for subscribing. And welcome, Jumpy, to the peaches, please. Liam, thank you so much for the bits. Uh, there was a light change to purple. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And a posture check as well, right? Thank you. Uh, let me just go ahead and pop it like that. 
We're kind of purpley already, but I will try and go a bit deeper purple. <gasps> Vibey, I love that. I'm going to drop this one. This one feels too high and it's doing like a white thing. So I will drop that before the next stream. Um, also, Jumpy, thank you so much for gifting a sub. Welcome to Squad New Peachy. Please make sure you say thank you to Jumpy. Lolo, thank you so much for the win. 200 bits to fuel that hype train from before. Woo woo. And then Courtney, thank you so much for the win. Two, three, four. Five gifted subs, a big, big, huge heart to you, Courtney. If you were just gifted by Courtney, please make sure you say a big thank you in the chat. And uh, welcome to the squad, new peaches. Okay, Draco is in here gardening. Riku energy right now. The good thing is we can also go ahead and sell all this stuff. Um, honestly, this is kind of your job, Violet. I'm just saying, as future cattle, one of your responsibilities is the garden. And okay, well... This is Draco's flirty painting. I'm not going to sell that. I think the emotional ones I want to keep a hold of. And we will go ahead and instead decorate his room. Can I make it bigger? Oh, I've got to do it in buy mode. That's <laughs> very modern taste, Draco, but I will allow it. There we go. Should I keep it as a canvas? I think he'd add a frame, but the frames aren't very, like vibey so i think i'm gonna keep it as a canvas there we go she's gonna wake up like what also do you notice all the red all of the blood you guys saying the stairs are overhanging now what from downstairs <gasps> oh yeah they go one out further on each side don't they um <laughs> i can't catch a break with this build i swear why does the bottom bit of them now not line up anymore why can't I like, I can't change this platform. Oh, I can't. Okay, boom. And then, <gasps> no, my scribe, not my scribe. <gasps> I'm gonna have to move my brand new fresh scribe. It's all stuck behind there, super annoying. Oh, this area is just kind of low key quite ugly now. Wait, can I move the stairs back in? Or maybe have this as two instead of three? It's just not as grand though. It's not symmetrical. What about if I put like a little wall here? Oh no, I can't because you're not. Yeah, it's just not gonna work, is it? Never mind. There's nothing I can do, so I must just accept it. We will put the scribe here so it's like opposite the organ. And that can we can do that instead. There we go. Thank you. This bu build is bullying me. I know, right? I'm in year eight all over again. Um, and today's mail has been delivered. Is that bills? Is that... Oh, Taurus are here. I want to eat them so bad. Yeah, we've got... No, we don't have bills. What mail are you delivering me then? I'll have to wait till nighttime to check. I am thirsty. I could go for a Taurus. I could go for a Taurus. Um, okay, why don't you do a quick little bit of dark meditation. And then I'm gonna switch him to move like a bot so that we can, um, no, I can just fly there as a bot. Just so that I can be outside for the minimum Hi. mark time possible Boy. and then I will eat a Taurus. A little Taurus nom nom. Make sure to save. Yes, thank you. Actually, while it saves, I really need a wee. And I'm looking after my bladder nowadays. You guys know this. So I will be back in one minute after I wee.
I kicked my camera over. <laughs> I kicked it over as I left. She's not in here anymore, so I'm actually just gonna go ahead and switch it off anyway. Oh, hello. I I'm gonna switch it off because she's not here, so there's not much point having it on, is there? Goodbye, Bean Come. Goodbye. Um, okay, and we were gonna fly here. Uh, so let's go ahead and fly here as a bat. And then you're the closest one, so it will be you. I uh, will go kill you. Wait, did you fly there? There you go. Okay, straight in and out, Draco. Straight in and out. Straight in and out. Straight in and out. No messing around. No messing around. Get your numbs and then go. Get your numbs and then go. Don't you just love it when the game does that? <laughs> just vibing away and then T pose. I just want to. I just want to eat you. I just want to eat you. I just want to eat. Look, I'm taking pictures of my home. You all deserve this. You've brought this upon yourself. Why are you feeling sad? Oh, yeah, because I killed your brother. Sorry about that. Wait, why didn't I kill him? What? Oh my gosh. Let's introduce ourselves to the guy then. We'll do your guys' technique. And then we will bring him inside. Quick! Add to group. Okay. Come inside, friendo, because I'm not going to lie. Um, this son is not the one. So inside you come. Come on. Come on. Is he coming in? The big Egypt, he is. Uh, okay, Violet, I don't think you knew this about me because I definitely uh, made you hallucinate last time. Um, so this is probably going to be a bit of a shock, but turns out I'm a vampire. This is actually a vampire's lair. Um, you're pregnant with a vampire. And... No, I've not heard of plasma fruit. We don't do that here. Also, I'm a murderous vampire, so yeah, that that is a thing that's happening. That is a thing that's happening. So yeah, she's like, oh no, sad cake, sad case. Oh, do we want to become a minor crime lord? Oh my gosh, she's watched one. She watched one death, and they're trying to recruit her into the mafia. Like no, oh, no, art critic. She's an art critic. Okay, you got work in three hours actually. How did you get to this when your writing skill and your painting skill are awful? I do not know, but please come... Oh, wait, what? <gasps> Why doesn't it work? Do I have to buy a part to go on it? Give me... A... Oh, wait. Wait till this death's finished and then... um, Bye! Bye, friendo! Yeah, get on with it. There you go. Um, I think I might need to buy a roll of paper to go on top. Her mum just tried to recruit her. What? Her mum is in... Oh, what? The plot thickens. The plot thickens, guys. And if you got work today, you got work in 19 hours. Okay. Why don't you do some more paintings? Do a stat painting, okay? We'll have a whole wall of paintings. I think it'll be beautiful. Go on. Crack on. Crack on. And brilliant. He has been reaped. Okay, there's definitely a piece I'm missing for this. Um, What was the brand... TSM. Oops. Uh, so there should be like a thing I put on them. <gasps> oh my gosh, what? Look at a little oil burner! <gasps> Physician shelves? Oh my gosh, what? Bookings? <gasps> a loot? Oh my gosh, yes. A loot is a must have. Okay, so we got... Which is the one that's meant to go on here? Bard computer. Well, surely it's one of these. But how do I put it on? How do I make it go on there? It's not It's not going on. Hmm. Hmm. Oops. Yeah, it's meant to like sit on here. Must be placed on a specific object. Which one are you? You're the gothic scribe. Should be you then. Hmm, let me just move these for a sec. Just float, okay. Oh, I can't put it on guys. <gasps> I can't put it on, it doesn't work. Let me see if any of the other ones work. That one does. 
Oh, the one design I want to use doesn't work. That is just the most sad thing I've ever heard. But it is what it is. Okay, let's go for this one instead. If anybody else has this, please let me know why it doesn't work. I don't know what I've done wrong. Like, I feel like this should be working absolutely perfectly because it's literally the CC from the website, but put it down off the platform first. No, look, it's not sitting on it. It's trying. Let me try one of the others. It's like it knows it's meant to go on there, but it doesn't It doesn't sit on. Let me try pulling the chair out. Nah, look. They just won't go on. Oh, well. We've got this one, at least. That one's definitely more vibey, but this one's still great, so... It's fine, guys. Just wipe these tears right out my eyes. Um, it's okay. <laughs> um, any other cool things I can add? A candle, maybe. Yes, and then I want these shelves, but they're a bit big. Should I like shrink them? I want a po oh, these apothecary shelves are the freaking one. Anything like this, and I am like all over. I love nonsense like that. Just my favorite. I'd have that in my real life house. Oh my gosh, look at this shelf too. Maybe you're better. I know I'm meant to be saving my money, but <laughs> lol. This is more fun! And, um, what are you? Oh, the athlete's trophy case. Lol, we have a trophy case with an empty glass in it. We are so civilized and refined. I can't really see you. Can I make you a bit lighter? There, that's better. Let's make you a bit lighter. <gasps> wow! So vibey! I need to stop spending now. Why is it just a piece of cake in my inventory? I don't know. I, I had move objects on, but it needs a specific item to be on, which even move objects cannot help with, I'm afraid. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Courtney, I caught your beautiful gifted subs. Um, and also, Edgar the Gamer, thank you so much for the bits. My final bits, Claire, I love you. I also want to say send you some kisses. Can I have some kisses back? Also, kisses through the chat. Lots of kisses today. Yes, pure Lexi energy. Have some kisses. Also, Livy, uh, Liv Livia, thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the Peaches. Violet can work from home. I'm going to make her work from home so that we can try out this cool table. Uh, what does she need to do? Level up her writing skill. Okay, let's give this a go. Writing. Right. Practice your writing. She's just like, oh, the Grim Reaper. What have I what have I come to here? What is this house? Why is there a frog in the middle of the floor? <gasps> and we've acquired the writing skill. Do you what We just did something there. <laughs> a thing just happened. I don't know what just happened, but something did. So level up writing skill and paint a mural. Paint a mural? Right. No, she's not doing that. Check on Lucifer. Yeah, she's instantly regretting everything. She's like, what did I do? Oh, Lucifer wants some food. Let's fill Lucifer. Give Lucifer some food, please. Light can change color to peach. Let me get on that. There we go. Peachy lights in the background. Enjoy. Uh, Livy, Livia, thank you so much for subscribing. Can you welcome Livy, Livia to the peaches, please? Leon, thank you so much for the bits. This time I just cheated because I felt Claire, bad for Claire having to deal with this chore of a build. This build is a complete nightmare. It really, really is. Here is the sad painting. I said I'd keep the emotional ones, but I may now be regretting everything. We'll do a confident one. <laughs> uh, it is a complete nightmare. Tizzy, thank you so much for the bits. I love your Zodiac cast. And immediately after watching it, I did Sagittarius makeup because I'm a Sag uh, Sagittarius. It looks so good and I can't wait to do it again. Thank you for the inspiration. I love that. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Emotaku, thank you so much for the bits. Have you ever thought of doing the Super Sim Challenge? Draco painted a masterpiece. Wait, was that a masterpiece? <gasps> oh, it's a masterpiece and it's but ugly. I'm going to sell it. Bada bing, bada boom. Um, what is the Super Sim Challenge? Please let me know. Zabiri, thank you so much for the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That is 1,000 bits. Thank you so, so much. Um, and Lucifer is glitched in the wall. Oh, no, he's eaten. He's fine. Look. He, he has escaped. <gasps> and what do we have? A loop Oh, look at the perfect like baby. Say what's mummy. Say what's mummy. 
Oh, look how shy you are on camera. It's In so real weird. life, like she's she such like she's a little camera. licky queen. How do you know you're on camera, Lexi? How do you know, Lexi? Wait, you don't give licks on. She's so shy. Why are you shy, baby? Why are you shy? Why are you shy? Oh. Why are you shy? She knows. Her personality is so different on camera. She needs a brush, you know. You little brushy washy. You little brushy, you little brushy, you little Am I still the most used emote, you reckon? Ah, uh, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> Spam Ali's. Ali and Lexi. Well, my arms are looking pretty big. Your arms look good. Well done. You've been working out recently. Nah, she needs to do arms tomorrow, so. Good girls. You haven't done dins. Um, how much longer do you think you'll stream for? Uh, I'll probably do one more, uh, one quick Yeah, recording. I do, because I got my lesson tonight. Oh, you do. Okay, I'll sort food out then. Okay, tomorrow. okay, thank you. Let's go. Thank you. Love you more. <laughs> little little Ali and Lexi break there. Um, oh, we're getting a phone call. Shouldn't you have a license for being that ugly? This guy just woke up this morning and chose violence. I'm off to hunt this guy down. Who are you? Where is this guy gone? Hurry, hurry. Hurry! Look at him. What an absolute chud. <laughs> Hurry's getting eaten. Hurry is like... I'm, I actually think I'm gonna lock Hurry downstairs and wait to get thirsty again and then eat him. So he can hang out in my mother's room. If he dies of th thirst... Har <laughs> He's called Harry Potter? Harry Potter just called me ugly. Harry Potter just called me ugly. How is this guy called Harry Potter? Where is where is the boy who lived? Where is he? Where is he? Who are you? Oh, you need to go. You need to go in the garden. Where's the boy who lived? It won't be the boy who lived for much longer. He'll be the boy who had a short life because of his own stupidity. Where is he? Where is this fool? Harry Potter. Foolishness, guys. Okay, let me see if I can add him to a group. He's scared. He's like, yeah, I'll come straight over. I've not seen hair and a tail of him. What you want, Harry? What you want, Potter? Come here, Potter! Come round to my mansion, Potter! Oh my gosh. And he said it's a Draco! No freaking way! Oh my gosh! Harry was the bully all along! Draco was the innocent one! Literally! What? 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 Is this my man? Is this him? Or is that just the mailman? I don't know who that is. Potter! Get here, Potter! How dare you! Oh, there he is! I, I have to investigate this man. I'm sorry, I just do. Because we may have just... He's, he's actually Harry Potter. He's actually Harry Potter. I just saw who his parents were. I think we've just found our new cattle. I think there's James Potter. There's Lily Potter. And here is Harry Potter. No, take the glasses off, Harry. You're a cattle, Harry! I can't actually... I'm gonna have to put Harry Potter CC on him. <laughs> Whoa! I can't. I can't. Get your little Harry Potter hair. Get your little Potter hair on. Where's the best colour option? <laughs> it is Plumbella save, so this makes sense. Where's his little glasses at? We've just found out this this is now going to 100% be our new cattle. He will serve us until we die and then he too will die. And it's what he deserves. There's these little Harry Potter glasses. They're quite big, actually. Is there some smaller ones? 
these ones. There we go. Did he have gold glasses? I think he did. Can I get to his eyes from there? Potter! <laughs> Literally, Potter was the bully the whole time. Don't believe the books, propaganda. It's propaganda, okay? It's actually just propaganda. Yes, there you go, your little thin English lips. Perfect. Did Potter have... Potter. <laughs> did Harry have the freckles? I don't think he did. <laughs> don't believe the bugs. Darker hair. Okay. There we go. Potter! Um, I might as well get you all ready in your suit because, um, you, you will serve us. How dare you call Draco ugly? How dare you? There you go. You can wear green because it's Draco's favorite color and you don't get choices anymore. Potter! He had freckles in the books. Did he have black hair? And black glasses? Oh, I thought he had gold glasses. There we go. Oh, I don't have the scar. I don't have the scar. Okay, next episode, somebody link me some scar CC or I'll search for some and we'll 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 put some scar CC on him. I don't think I've got the scar. I think I used her. The weird thing is, I think I used her. Yeah, he's got a little brother called Kerry Potter. Kerry Potter! He's not a spellcaster though. He's a child of the ocean, adventurous recycle disciple. They're not spellcasters either. Why are we making Harry Potter? Oh, we are not. We are not. Should we do him a bit more like the books then? Should I give him black hair? And freckles, more like the books? Or should I make him like the movies? He has no freckles. I don't know which, which version of him to do. I think I'm going to do the movies one because it's just... That's how he looks in my head, you know? So we'll do the movie one. I don't want to spend ages on him because he's a rat, so... Yeah, both of his... um, Both of his parents were spellcasters. I'm getting him dressed up in this form already because he'll be staying in this. And we're going to make him cuddle. I thought we were going to drink him, but no. No. He brought this on himself. He can also bring us some money. So. There are Max's scars? What do you mean? I don't like the black hair as much. I don't like the black hair as much. Uh, Courtney, thank you so much for the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one thousand bits. A big, a huge heart for you. Thank you so, so much. And Liv Leah, thank you so much for the bits as well. Liam, thank you so much for the bits. The chair should have its own emo. Chair Siobhan, yes. Chair Siobhan is an icon. Where is this little rat gone? You're looking for Hedwig. You're looking for Hedwig. Oh, no. Um. Okay, we need to get him to join the household, which means I need to make him like me. But it's fine. We'll torture him in the long run. Your brother's calling to chat. I will allow it. After you finished your work, of course. Uh, I w if I want his money, I need to make him join the household. So I have to chat with stupid Harry. Oh, look at us. Oh, look, pretending that we're friends. Sat here having a chit chat. Like, you literally hate this guy so much. I'm going to have to micromanage this conversation, aren't I? Harry, why don't we get a nice little picture together? Oh, yay. Fuck with me and you, Harry. Look, look at his annoying little... So annoying. The potters are rich steal that money. Stop chit-chatting because you're only going to hate each other more. Just take pictures. Look, Harry's pure rat. Absolute pure rat. Okay, this should make each them like each other. Oh, look at him revealing his red eyes. Like, <laughs> I will feast on your blood for the rest of my immortal life. Okay, is that- do they like each other at all yet? Where are you, Harry? How dare you wore what he once wore! Um, poor Riku. He's a poor imitation, isn't he? Okay, this- this is the most hux way ever to get someone to like you, honestly. Oh gosh, look at them both. Yeah, 
Uh, Yay, more pictures. Do I have to look at their stupid faces? Oh, look, I don't even have to do it that time. Brilliant. And how much do you guys like each other? Are you, like, becoming friendos yet? My game is running slow. Um, friendly. Hmm. Who's your favourite author, Hari? I wonder who it could be. Uh, and apologise. I'm so sorry we started off on the wrong foot, Harry. I say we become friends. Would you like to move into this household? You can have a room! Just like this one! Just like this one, Harry! A big, huge, beautiful room! What do you say, Harry? Harry's moving in. How are you moving? I'll deal with the finances. Don't you even worry, Harry. Thanks, Harry! Did you see the shooting stars today? Judith, didn't I kill you ages ago? <laughs> um, and now that that's out the way, we can reveal our true form. And we can immediately compel for a deep drink. Just to punish him. And, oh my gosh, guys, we were wondering. Wait, 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 no. Do cattle, do the cattle thing, do the cattle thing. No, 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 do the cattle thing. How do I make him my cattle? How do I do it, guys? I've forgotten how to do the cattle thing. <laughs> this is the best episode. I've forgotten how to make him my cattle. How did I do it? You need the vampire trait. His points. I need the life spirit. Do you have to be a master vamp? You need a vampire trait. Uh, do I buy it with points? Why can I never remember how to bring up this stupid menu? How do I get it? I can't remember how we did it at all. Is it on here? Is it one of these? It's under, no, under the vampire points. Ah. Oh. We've got six points. We could do this. Which one is it? Is it this one? No, it's life spirit, isn't it? I think I need to become a next level vampire, don't I? Vampire points, not rewards. Do I need to- I have to level up. I'm gonna get this one, by the way, because then I can move like a bat more. Which is pretty useful, right? So let me get that. And then, how do I increase this again? Do I just, like, drink and stuff? Drink plasma. I'm just gonna have some nom noms for now. I'm gonna eat some of my, more of my pear, because I'm hungry. Mm -mm. Yes, Harry! Get used to this! You are gonna be iron deficient for the rest of your days. Mmm. We need to get Harry to become a gardener as well. Find a job, Porter! Don't worry, I'm not doing a deep drink. Oh, he's gotta recover from his plasma drain first. And then get yourself a job, and then get downstairs and get gardening, Potter. This is what Harry deserves. It's what you deserve, Potter. And downstairs we've got um, poor, <laughs> poor little Violet. See, I told you Draco was evil. Now that she's pregnant, she can't go anywhere, so he can reveal his evil vampire nature. And now he's like, ah. Oh. <laughs> After all that, I think I need uh, myself- Wait, what you have to go do? Don't go mourning. You don't need to mourn anyone. Go ponder world domination and have yourself a nice tasty little- Little Yorkfield Classic 16, you know? Mini workout! Okay! After all that evilness, I think I need to do a little workout. So this is good. So we've done punching. We've done ups. Now we do tries. Okay. Try time, guys. Get your weights. We're gonna be going like this. That's how we do tries, okay? Three, two, one, go, one. Oh, the bean is back, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 
15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Oh my gosh. And I can put bean cam back on. Thank you for the mini workout. I actually like doing them. Don't worry. I know I act in pain the whole time, but I do like them. <laughs> Beanie. Oh. Hello, gorgeous. Good girl. It's you. You're the good girl. There we go. A beanie bubbly roo. Joe Wicks who exactly? So here we go. We're off to go ponder. Harry, what's your, you going to be? Uh, where's the gardener? There we go. Because then I can get seeds and stuff from work. And it helps us out with this as well. So become a gardener, Potter. Should you do your work assignment? Yes. Did they give you some seeds? What's this? Trash you've got? Uh, what do you need to do to get ahead? Purchase some garden seeds. Well, we will allow for you to do that. Um, instead, you can go downstairs and learn how to garden, I guess. Um, is anything you doing? No, I guess not. Don't plant any garlic, though. I swear, don't you dare. You in my bed? Get out of there, Russ! That is not your bed. This is your bed, Harry. Assign bed. Oh, Harry, look, a task. This is going to be your toilet. You will not get to use my toilet. I suggest you learn how to repair it. <gasps> Did Evie and Lexi just nose boop? Is, is Lexi in here? Oh, I missed that. Did they do a cute thing? Yeah, we'll be able to get another cow plan. Yeah, lock the door to him. Lock the door for specific sim. Oh, no, he can't. Okay, I have to do it as, as Draco. Lock door for... Potter! Oh, my gosh. This was the best thing that could have happened. Um, Sorry, I'm still trying to catch up. Um, Zabiri, I caught your 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I think a thousand emotes. A big, big thank you. Also, Courtney with the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10. A thousand, e a thousand emotes. Well, a thousand bits. Thank you so, so much. Peachy Simmer, thank you so much for being here for two months in a row. V Ravenstar, thank you so much for gifting a sub. Welcome to the squad, uh, new Peachy. Are they still trying to use that downstairs toilet? No, they're not. I'm going to lock this, by the way, for everybody except... Like, nobody else is allowed in here except Harry. This is just, like, the room's too gross. And um, these two, no, we're not going in there. Um... Uh, da, 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 da. What was I doing? Sorry. Uh, PG Summer, I got your two mums. Yeah, and Ravenstar gives it a sub. Make sure I say thank you to Ravenstar if you were gifted. Thank you so much for the uh, gifted sub. Uh, Bree Bree, thank you so much for the birds. James Turner has a whole playlist of it. It's where you try and get all the sims with one skim, sim and complete all aspirations and all jobs. You can use a potion of youth and reward potion to stay young. Oh my gosh, that sounds so hard. That's wild. And, um... Ali, Alia Evergreen, thank you so much for subscribing. Can we welcome um, uh, Exalia Evergreen to the peaches, please? And Liam, thank you so much for the bitch. You should turn Harry Potter into a spellcaster and make him work for Draco. I don't want to allow him any joy in life, though. Look at him. Trying to come over and scare Draco. Draco's a vampire. You should be scared, Harry. Have you... Oh. Oh, oh. What is happening right now? Why... Why are you revealing yourself to Potter? Get out of Potter's room! No, get here! Leave! Why would you do that? Get! Oh my gosh, I can't believe you did that! I can't believe you went in there! What were you thinking? What were you thinking? And also, oh, I let her wee herself. Okay, fair. <laughs> I'm not a good sim owner. I didn't mean to lock her in there, okay? I didn't mean to. Liam, thank you for the bit. Spellcaster Cattle. I don't want to give him any joy in life, though. Silky Gamer, thank you so much for the bits. I feel like I'm the only one who doesn't find Draco uh, from Harry Potter. It's like hot slash attractive. I did when I was like a little kid. Um, when the movies first came out. Now it's just more for the memes. And Spicy Misu, thank you so much for the bits. Do you mean to tell me Harry Potter is Harry Potter is now Draco's slave? Yes. Also, Claire, thank you for being a Harry Potter slash Avatar nerd like me. I love both of them. I love both of them. And um, how dare you sit there? I f you're not doing... You're playing... Bl no. I feel like you're not doing any anywhere near enough chores right now. Can I not find something for you to do? There must be something you can do. Um, why don't you patrol the neighborhood and look for things? Look, go and dig this, Potter. And then dig that, Potter. And then dig that as well, Potter. 
You need tasks. Potter. I can't believe. I can't believe Harry Potter just messaged to say you're ugly. And this is what has now happened to his life. He deserves every bit of this. Oh my gosh, I should make him a house under the stairs. But it's a platform. It's a platform, so I can't. He lives in this instead. Oh my gosh. Next episode, we legit, though, might have to make him a cupboard under the stairs and put him in there. Because it's what he deserves. Scavenge for parts, Potter. Because you're gonna need them to repair everything that you break. Harry Potter found a time capsule. Don't enjoy it for long. Also, you won't need any more education, so you can sell that. What? I just got back. Why are you aggressively calling Potter? <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at Draco just sat here like, what do you expect me to do with this? I am a vampire pilot. Why have you given me eggs on toast? What do you... He's like... Oh my god, this is so gross, this is so gross. I, uh, uh, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. I think he's only even eating it because he's drunk. Oh yeah, I was supposed to be leveling you up, wasn't I? Um, Dark meditation, please. What do you want to do to Potter? Drink his blood. <laughs> Things you love to see. <laughs> oh my gosh. Every episode, this this series just likes to throw something wild at me. Literally wild at me. And I love it for that. Didn't I eat a... Oh, wait, look. A dead person in the hallway. Um, Didn't I throw a book on the hallway here? And I was like, oh, we will have to study vampire law. And then I just totally don't know where I put it. <gasps> Party in the graveyard. Thorn Bailey's having a fight with Melee. Wow, we joined at a good time. Being watched by Roman Hoots. Wait, isn't that the dad? How has his ghost stuck around for so long? I don't know. This is Draco's father. This is some ghosts with no physical form. Somehow having a physical fight. Don't understand what, I don't know how, but there you go. Turns out even the ghosts can't stand each other. And oh yeah, I was gonna check my mail once it wasn't bright, wasn't I? So let's go check the mail. Did you invite the siblings? I haven't. It's 1 a.m. though, so I can't invite them now. We honestly, I think I'm gonna have to save that for the next episode. Wait, Roman is his uncle. Oh, who is his dad? What's his dad's called? I forget. <laughs> he wasn't that important. Ashton, Ashton is the dad, isn't it? And honestly, I'm so proud of how far Draco's come in one episode. He's got himself a vampire's thrall. Who, are you meant to be pregnant? You don't, you don't look very pregnant. Are you pregnant? You are. Second trimester? Really? Oh, yeah, I can see it. She is pregnant. A little strawberry pregnancy. She's got clumping around in her high heels, looking very cute. Um, so, yeah, we've got... He He's now the official heir. He kicked out his sister to go and kill the world. He found himself a vampire's thrall and got her pregnant. She's in her second trimester. Harry Potter called him ugly, so he condemned him to internal da eternal damnation. And he became our slave. Um, and this is just all going really well. Really, really well. He's still not done a day's work in his new job yet. But can I do a dazed painting? Oh, shame. Uh, and this is your newest painting. Honestly, the, the emotion paintings are so trash. I'm just going to sell it. I am just going to sell it. And we've got a bunch of money. Next episode, we'll be able to do... Something really cool. Um, should I paint new girly? Yeah, come down here. I'll paint you. Stop talking to Potter. Come here instead. I will. I will be very lovely and paint you. You don't understand how much of a like paint from reference large painting. Face forward. Face forward. What are you doing? Hurry up. Face forward. Face forward. No. 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 You don't understand how much of an honor this is. I usually reserve. Oh, beautiful. Wow. Um, I usually reserve this for vampires, but technically there is a vampire in this painting. It's just in your tum tum. So, <gasps> what if her baby's not a vampire? Should I keep it still? Like, I mean, keep it in the house. Like, it'll be born, so we'll, we'll, we'll be there. But like, I might have to keep having babies until we get a vampire baby. Nah, kill him. <laughs> Leon, thank you so much for the bits. You need to kill Harry's parents before Harry's eyes. 
Oh my gosh, that is the best idea. We will do that next episode. And um, also, thank you for the bits again, Liam. Even the ghosts are fighting before vampires. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, she's starting to not like him as a person. She's starting to realize that he is a rat, but she does find him a genuine hottie. So it's, it's a confusing time for her. It is a confusing time. Oh, okay, yeah, she realizes he's a complete douche. He hid it for a while. He did hide it for a while, but she's like, damn, you're so mean, but you're so hot. Um, and I've told you, you're not allowed to use that. In fact, I'm going to lock you out of this. You're not allowed any fun in life. Do stuff. That's the only fun you're allowed. Um, lock for specific sim. How do I do that? Computer. No computer for you, Porter! Should I, I should get him an owl. He's like, hmm, I should buy an owl. <laughs> Lot trait for vampire babies. I f Do we already have that? We've got that, yeah. We've got on a dark ley line, so we're all good. We're all good with that one. We also got this collectible plate. Maybe that can go in my trophy cabinet. Yeah, I'm gonna put that in my trophy cabinet. Instead of just a glass here. Have the plates. And what are these? A pile of fur. No thanks. Thanks, but no thanks. And I will give this to uh, Porter for upgrading. This is going to end up really hurting my throat. Oh my gosh, Porter! Why is the bo- Oh, no, it's fine. You can just fill it. I thought it was stinky. How do you have access to the two rooms behind the stairs? I don't yet. We're planning on those. You'll probably have to go through the dining room to get to them, though. You just came from half a stream. I hope it was fun. Okay. Uh, is there going to be a raid today? There is, there is, there is. And I was really hoping for a baby this episode. But we're not even in trimester three yet. So I think we're going to have to wait for the next episode. However, look at this beautiful painting. Look at this beautiful painting. The vampire baby is there just inside of the tum tum. We're stressed. Okay, we're not going to be able to finish it because we're hung over. We are so hungover. He really wants to gain a vampire rank. I'm actually going to lock that in. Because I too would like you to gain a vampire rank, Draco. But you're just not there yet. You're nearly there. How far off are you? Bit of dark meditation. We'll bump you up a little bit more. Is that going up? I think it is. It doesn't go up very much. Also, can you get it by sleeping? Does, does hibernating give him it as well? Violet's like napping on the bed. I'm gonna go and hibernate in here to increase my vampire power. Uh, he needs to read the vampire books. Ah, look at these lovebirds. This is how, wait, did I just tell him to get into the bed? No, no, why don't you go to sleep? Go to sleep. This is how these young lovers sleep. One of them in here and one of them in there. <laughs> right, so. Improvements to the house. Improvements to the line. Because there's a new baby coming. We've got a Harry Potter slave. we got Maya released into the world. we got so much. So much happened this episode. Honestly, it was absolutely freaking wild. And it was so, so much fun. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please enjoy the bean cam for a little while. While I figure out who we are going to raid. Did you guys have fun today? This was the most fun. The most fun I think I've had because of the Harry Potter thing in this series so far. I thought last episode was fun, but this one just honestly knocked it out the park. If you are on the YouTubes, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, I will see you guys in the next episode of this, which is going to have babies and Harry Potter slaves and all sorts. It's going to be incredible. So I will see you guys there. Thank you so, so much for watching. Goodbye.